I, th I, th I think it was like a month this time. We've been busy. You've been busy. Yeah. Yeah. So since the last time we streamed and this time, I have uh, I've moved to another place. That's right. You are now um, in your own place own for the first time. Not sure. Yeah. Anybody. Ever. Like ever. Like. Uh, so we were roommates, and then I was living with my parents, and now I'm uh, no longer doing either. I'm in my own place. It's you rented a good. room at someone's house at one point, because that's kind of what you have to do with rent around here. Yeah. Um, fortunately, I make enough that I'm able to uh, to live in a studio without much problem, and uh, it's been good. I've, j I've been able to just kind of... Uh... So this is our stress test. We're seeing how well this goes. Uh, you were just at the entrance to this cave here. Oh, is this the entrance? Yeah. Shit, I'm not done with the cave. Going into Charge Stone Cave. Okay, <laughs> Once again, like... I don't know what the fuck any of my Pokemon are or do. I, I know we say this over and over we get to this, but we gotta watch Memento at some point. Yeah. Because it... every single time we do this, it's like, it's like a scene in Memento. <laughs> All right, let's just watch the previous stream in reverse to find out where we were. How did we get what? here? Wait, what? Oh my god, I've been, I've been ambushed by ninjas. Oh, it's uh, it's this guy. It's in. I am the ult. I feel like this guy should be voiced by the guy who voices Memphis, Tennessee in the Snap Cube. Yeah. Ah oh, yes, that was the Shadow Triad just now. Get this enlisted them in Team Plasma. He does seem like a guy who takes himself way too seriously, right? <laughs> yeah. Anyway, wh wh where are we dropping, boys? They were the ones who prepared the Galvantula nest at the cave entrance. Chartstone Cave. I like this place. Could replace Tilted Tower. Dead memes. Is it, uh, sorry, is that a Fortnite voice? No, no, the, you've never seen this, that, that, uh, it's, the whole joke is that Memphis, Tennessee was obsessed with Fortnite. Okay, no, I missed that part. I just thought it was a funny <laughs> Mephilus voice. It, it, yeah, it, it is a funny Mephilus voice. And it's I, just, I wasn't aware of the Fortnite part. It's the, the it's fun. <laughs> Imagine somebody like talking like that, except they're talking about some completely mundane and irre irrelevant shit. Yeah. Like, I've taken the bus line from Detroit, Michigan, all the way down to Texas. It was most unpleasant. You say that like it's a part of some grand scheme. Yes. I have I have observed the people as I have gone down this bus line. Is that the, you know, is that a thing? It, are are there like a, a villain character that does like really petty things to try to do do, do evil? <laughs> uh, the, I feel like I've I've seen that before. Solid JJ's version of Reverse Flash. <laughs> it was I who expired your milkberry. If people did not exist, this would be an ideal place. No, <laughs> you didn't like that. <laughs> uh, if you don't understand what that means, it's not likely to surprise you. I told... Getsis? Gherkin. Gherkin Pickle about you and your friends. Gherkin Pickle? Gherkin Piccolo sounds like, a, sounds like a joke form that Piccolo would turn into. After I did, he apparently used the Shadow Triad. All these fucking proper nouns. Yeah, by the way, there are just ninjas now. I mean, there, there were, were there were ninjas in like Gen One Pokemon, but they didn't do ninja stuff. They just dressed like ninjas. Okay, they did they did do ninja stuff first and foremost. They, you know, they Anime hid. doesn't count. No, they did in the previous game. There were fucking ninjas that like leapt out in the, like tall grass. Eh, that was just oh, kids yeah. hiding in dirt. It's still ninjas, <laughs> does it? Yeah. Okay, you didn't specify good ninjas. You just specified people who okay. had who. These are, these are the first ninjas who appear to have actual superpowers in Pokemon. Yes. There you, go. there you go. There you go. Like Naruto level ninjas. Not fun. Or, or uh, this counts to Godfrey Ho ninjas. Poor Bianca faced the sad truth that not everyone can become stronger. Oh no, what'd you do to her? 
Did you, did you monsters, did you beat her in a Pokemon battle? Terrible. And you are not more of a... A good thing. What? Team he likes plasma. that we're neutral. We're... we're... Yes, this was this you, okay? Who the fuck is... Have we met this dude before? I don't know. Dude, don't, I don't remember. You're just talking this about is... some dude I've never met. It's very sus. No, but you have met him. I don't remember. Look, I got this short-term memory problem. Oh, we did. Uh, he was the dude who, like, confronted the cowboy and, and took the sage away so he couldn't be arrested. Look, I need a Polaroid to take picture. Okay, yeah, you're right. Look, we need, I need to take a Polaroid to just, like, take pictures of all these people. Man, remember the featured last gen that told us everything we did last stream? Like, as soon as we booted up? Yeah, that's so last season. Okay, well, uh... Anyway, hello, Darian. Sorry, it took, I... I saw you. Hello. Grass gem. That's Got any rest healing thing. items? Hey! Oh, hey, are you okay? I heard that... Jay Cool, did you know this? The floating stones move when you touch them! You... Wait, Professor? Hey, Juniper! Okay. Some of the stones are floating because of magnets, I get it. But not all the stones can be pushed. Research Clink that looks like a, it's a Pokemon that looks like a gear. I'm researching the origins of Pokemon in the era they appeared. Okay. Well, oh, you give me Lucky Egg. Would you like a nice egg in these trying times? Give it. Give it's it actually a good look. item. It increases XP points. Oh. Okay, so if I want to power level a Pokemon, I just give it to them instead of just giving them on the EXP. I'm going to expertly dodge this dude. I gotta, I gotta learn how to silence my phone. Let's put this over here. Okay. Uh, bag. Okay, who's going to give this to? I might as well give it to somebody. Uh, who needs to level up? You know what? Fuck it, Musashi. You, you get the... Drinks in the power of a grass-type move, but only once. Once per battle, or, or you just use it, and then the Chaos Emerald, like, shatters. It's just gone. God damn it. You know, for competitive... Does it power up Leech Seed? You need, like, Super Leech Seed somebody? I probably. It's probably, like, 1.5 times power. Oh, no, not Leech Seed, because that's a status move. Yeah. Remember in Gen 1 when Leech Seed worked, like, Toxic? Uh, when it, yeah, crossed over with the Toxic, uh, counter. I'm the Professor's Bodyguard! Didn't N say he beat you, lady? No? Well, he called her weak. I don't think she gives a shit. Yeah. He's just oh. rude. I, I get, yeah. like, incel vibes from N. I hate incel, to say it. Incel. incel. And the, it, like, an incel who thinks he's, like, an NTR. Like, dude. Okay, well, I, I better catch this one. Smeargle. Okay, you... So this is the Magnemite, uh, replacement, right? Uh, in, in that it's, it's metal. Well, I mean, yeah, okay. Punch this dude. Ah, fuck, I killed it in one, sh don't know my own strength. Oh yeah, Hot Kong is your glass cannon. Okay, well, uh... Better switch it out with uh, something that's like way uh, slightly weaker. Um, still strong against psychic. Weak against fighting. I don't have any fighting moves. This would be a place to level up your crocodile because it's got electric Pokemon. 
It's already got the EXP share, but yeah, I see what you mean. Oh, what? Oh, there's a cutscene. Oh, we're, we're in the same area. Yeah. We're in the cave. <clears throat> Go deeper into your cave. Let the healing energy flow around you. Now find your power, Pokemon. Are these jail crystals? J jail crystals? No, no, don't worry about it. Hello, Elf King. What is that? A, what is that a reference to? Don't worry about it. <laughs> did you did you did you watch ahead in something that we were in the middle of? No. Okay. Okay, that's not gonna work. Uh, Elf King, what what is randomized? Uh, Pokemon encounters, trainer Pokemon, Pokemon types, move types, as well as move power and accuracy. Also abilities. I don't think I ran. I this time I did not randomize evolutions. Yeah, good idea. You want to like turn your turn your uh, level uh, something. Uh, Charmeleon into a level higher of, like, Caterpie. Honestly, this is the least randomized one that we've done, and it's still probably too much, because, uh, I, I don't know what the fuck, for example, this Registeel is. I don't know what'll be super effective on it. Just I don't take memorize Polar 600 Pokemon from nothing. See, what you gotta do is you gotta take a Polaroid of each Pokemon and then write it down on, like, yeah. on, like, uh, under, in the margins. I need an Excel <laughs> sheet. You gotta, and then uh, gotta remember the Pokemon trainer, Sammy Jake. Uh, stats are also randomized, Elf. But oh, I'm uh, running out. I think they what? generally stay within the same kind of stat totals. So something like a Legendary or a Dragonite is still going to be most likely good. I'm like, like a dude, Legendary Caterpie though. Get a uh, get a magic card with just absurd stats. So on the topic of absurd stats, the uh, Battle Network collection is out. You've been playing that, I uh, I notice. I just started it today. I'm playing through one through three since we streamed the Game Boy versions of those. And uh, there's a feature called Buster Max mode. What? <laughs> and what do you think that is? Buster only, and you and anything you get will level it up. Uh, no. It's something you can turn on and off, like, at any time okay. you want to. And it's okay. basically god mode in Doom. Oh, so you just don't take damage. No, no. See, I thought that Buster Max... I think there's, like, a, a thing called Buster Max in the games? Yeah, 3 had a, had a program upgrade. And it would set your buster stats to the maximum that they could be in the game, which is uh, like, like five damage, five charge, you know. Okay. But uh, no, that's not what it is. It sets your buster damage to 100. That sounds boring. It's, that's, yeah. that's kind of overpowered, but that also just sounds like... <laughs> it's, it's nice in a game like Battle Network 1, which didn't have running from viruses because it takes away the tedium. You just steamroll all the viruses. It just d d destroys the rest of the game, though. So, so theoretically, if you wanted to be trusted, you just do that for grinding, and then not much else. It's also or kind just... of a pain because because it's not an emulator. There's no speed up. There's no rewind. There's no save states. And oh, it's, it's oh, it's winter. I don't even have the uh, like the A B start select to fast reset, which you do a lot in Battle Network. There, there's a house here, right? Yeah, cool. Yeah, I think you can heal here. No, I can't. Shit. Can't you? Talk to the can lady. You? Heal me. Okay, good. I'm just rest on the... So, yeah, okay. Uh... I, it's nice, especially because there's... There's multiple achievements. There's one for beating Battle Network 3 blue, and one for beating white, so that's gonna be annoying. I- they- so it's technically five games. Uh, well, that- three was when they started doing multiple versions, so- Oh, yeah. One through three is four games. Oh, I don't think. Four through six is another six games. 
All right, crook. It does look good, though. I'm mean, for a GBA game, but uh, they didn't remaster the graphics at all. They did. Okay. It has like new non-pixely font, and the graphics are still kind of pixely, but not the way they would look if it was just GBA upscaled. I gotta, I gotta get Lucky Egg on Crook if he's, because if he's on in front with the EXP share, then there's no really real point. I'm glad you're enjoying that. That sounds. I'm still waiting for Advanced Wars, uh, the Advanced Wars One and Two remastered to come out, because I, I, you know, I was a fan of that game growing up. Yeah. Had it on Game Boy Advance. Well, at least the second one. I didn't get the first one until later. And yeah, it's just, it's just. Oh, I feel like it's just a cave butter free. Sorry, Beautifly. Cave butter free. <laughs> that sounds like that sounds like a region variant. Just like a creepy ass uh, butter free that like that like just dwells only in caves and shit. It's got like maybe bioluminescence on the wings and and like eyes and stuff. That'd be me, cool. You still here, Elf? Let me look at my party. You probably looked at it because I, I looked at the at the stats real quick. Get in the ball, Joltik. I've gotten some, like, really broken stuff in previous randomizer runs. I don't think I've gotten anything quite like that thus far. Can't believe that worked. Okay, cool. Be nice to get a, a Ghost Dark. That doesn't still have any weaknesses currently. Oh, yeah. I, I thought you meant in general for a second. Like, hey, Ghost Dark. Just have a Pokemon that's just Ghost Dark. There have been a couple of those. Well, then that, that's but then they added fairy so that they could reasonably do that. Yeah. Joltik, the I believe the smallest Pokemon. Despite it looking bigger than. It's yeah. an electric bug. Okay, your your name is. Oh, nope, not that. Go. Even zoomed in, our screens are really small. Our bottom screens. Gwyn! You are Gwyn. Gwyn? Spider Gwyn. Ah. Is it Spider? Thank God my Dragoner has run away. Yeah, I, I thought... <laughs> I thought you were saying, oh, he ran away. Good, I didn't like it. <laughs> okay, uh... Shit, what was I gonna do? There's there's multiple Reggies in this cave. Get item. <sighs> do I have any balls? Get item. I have some. Give item. You get the lucky egg. Where, where's my egg? Lucky egg. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, come on! Okay. Oh. That's not a, an electric type. Boldor. Oh, this thing. Okay, I remember it now. Uh, sand tomb. That's the Geo dude. Still super effective. Graveler. Oh, you're mud slapping me. You. Ma. <laughs> I thought. <laughs> I thought for a second you were calling Boldor a mumble rapper. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't have a mouth. I'm a rock I'm going into the clouds. All the rock is doing my ass. Miss my wife. I miss my wife. I don't know where I was. My dark type moves do more damage than my ground type. Move. What the fuck? Oh, rock rock attack. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't have a good ground move yet, does he? Is it Sandstone Tomb or something? Sand Tomb is the only one that's like uh, useful. I don't want this guy. 
Oh, you avoid it. Oh, s Ah! Don't kill my fucking crocodile! Okay, good. Just do it. I got a better rock. What is it actually, though? It's a dragon! Yeah, Reggie Rock. It's made out- it's- it, it's called that because it's just made completely out of dragon scales. Thereby looking like a rock. But it's not a rock. Hello, baby Clara Mirabelle. Cool. If you're new to the stream, hello, I'm Zelrog. I'm, I'm, I'm the randomized one. That's Jack. Uh, I'm playing just playing it normally, just casually, because I'm, I'm trying to be chill these days. Do you have a Pika? I don't remember if I found a Pika. I would have to check my PC, and I'm currently in a cave. So you know how you know I like pro wrestling, right, Zelrog? Yeah. Oh yeah, Fungus. I already have one. Uh. I came up with a uh, with a storyline for just a generic storyline that any pro wrestlers can fit into. You want to hear it? Okay. Is it long? Uh, I can sum it up. All right, go for it. So it begins with two wrestlers and they hate each other, right? And they have matches, but it seems like no matter who wins or whatever, it just won't end. Like they just won't let go, and then finally the promoter gets sick of them. Just like interfering in each other's matches, wrecking the place. And so they decide, you know what we're going to do? Have one match. Whoever wins, wins. And whoever loses, leaves the company. I'm done with this shit. And so one wins, the other person leaves. But then the guy keeps coming back and like breaking into the arena, attacking him and attacking him outside the arena. And then finally the promoter's like, okay, I have had it. Enough is truly enough. You know what I'm going to do this time? It's gonna be you and you, but instead of, but it's not gonna be loser leaves the company. Oh no, it's gonna be loser leaves this dimension. Yeah. So, so the day the match comes, right, and the announcer just is like uh, goes, "All right, this following match is gonna be a loser leaves this dimension match," and the lights go out, and you hear the Doctor Who TARDIS, right? Just a boop, boop, and then it appears. Either like an elaborate looking like a uh, like prop or just like something made out of cardboard. I don't. It could be either one. Five times. Jesus fucking Christ. These things. These things are more trouble than they're worth. A lot of defense. So then one of them wins, and, the, and then the and then the guy's like sitting there just in shock, going, I "Can't believe he lost." And then the promoter comes out. He's like, "Well, the uh, it said loser leaves the submission, so." Goodbye, and he motions, and, the, and a few wrestlers and people come up, and they drag him. He's like trying to kick and scream and go, and they drag him. They throw him in the prop. They shut it. The lights go out, and you hear the warping again, and it opens up, and it's gone. Yeah. <laughs> I like. I, I want to see more like promotion, like story outline ideas like that. I think that's. I'm sure it would be wacky. What's, what's your a stable favorite? that would do that? What's what? What's a what's a, a stable a program that would do that? Like TNA. Yeah, Impact. Right. No, it has to be more wackier. Chikara would do that if they were still around. It's total Chikara shit. Oh, my favorite legendary Pokemon. Because uh, somebody asked, was a uh, Mew. I still like my uh, mischievous psychic cat. It's probably mine too. Although for more practical reasons, I just like that it can learn all the TMs. I don't is... know how I feel about the fact that it's apparently, like, super mean-spirited, or supposed to be. That actually makes me like it more, because it's like True Fae. Yeah. Like how like how the True Fae would... Be... Oh, god damn it! I think Crook is dead. Nope, still alive. Yeah, you do, would ideally want a special attacker on, the, on this thing. Please hit. Please. Okay, good. Oh, what?! Are you serious? Okay, I'm still alive. I'm gonna erode you. You know what? You know what? I'm just gonna heal. Oh, that's 200. That's I don't know what this thing is, but it's a terrible matchup for me. The weeping bell? Yeah. Mew.
<laughs> like that uh that in the mo like in the dub of the movie, uh Mew was like, We gotta all live in peace Whereas apparently in the original Japanese version it was like, You're not a real Pokemon You're just a failure. Was it like Oh crunch! Okay. Yeah, sure, you know what? I need a more powerful bite. I think that's more powerful. Fuck yeah, 80. 80 doctor, to uh... All healing items. Come on, Sand Gator. When does... When does he level up? Does he level up? Uh, yeah, he evolves, yeah. Or, sorry, that's what I meant. He's in his first form of three. Let me guess, it's another fucking drip. Okay, no, it's a Joltik. I can I can eat this thing really easily. Uh, go fly, my Absol. I must go. My planet needs me. Imagine teaching Metronome to Storlax, and Storlax uses fly. I have had that happen in Pokemon Stadium. That's funny. It's just it's just laying down in the air. And you're like, what the fuck? There's no animation. He just floats up. Oh, that'd be a great project. What? You just do like you just do a fan a fan made game a fan uh, like a region of Pokemon, but it's just the original like 151, except it's all like region variants, kind of like how Fool's Gold was. Yeah. So, but just that, except for except like it's all Twin Peaks style. So we should make the fire fighting decks into a game, all fire and fighting types, nothing else. That'd be so boring though, yeah. like. So, I'm trying to think, because I, 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 you know, I came up with that uh, idea for the uh, region variant of uh, Pikachu that was all like a detective. It was like okay. the, the uh, well, so you have Pikachu, right? And it's like, it has like, like rags covering it. And its whole thing was to keep body heat and, uh, and it would like chew sticks in order to like burn off excess electricity. And it would evolve into Pika Sleuth. Because okay. get it, Detective, Chief, Detective Pikachu. Yeah, no, no, I got it. And it's like a, it's smoking like a cigarette, except it's like a branch, and yeah. So <clears throat> I had another idea. I don't know if I talked about the uh, region variant for Snorlax. Instead of it being normal type, it'd be psychic type, and uh, it sleeps, but it's all, but it's like hyper aware all the time, and it uses its dreams to play with children, and it would evolve into Dreamlax. Oh. And, it, and the Pokédex entry would be like. There's a rumor that this that the entire region is like just a dream of several dreamlaxes. Okay. Well, you're not. Uh, I, I, I thought I think it'd be cool. Sure. It's like it's like a cool dex entry. All right. Okay. I guess we're gonna do this fucking dungeon at some point. All right. Sorry, did I say dungeon? I meant cave. No way through, but through. God damn it! Ugh. Just run, Jack. They're rocks. They're slow as shit. I need the EXP for there's, my rocks. There's trainers in here. Are, are, oh, there are? Okay. Yeah. We're running. Okay. You're, yeah, they're slow. Very big, but they're slow. I'll fight things that aren't those. Slugs. Do we need them? It's either free EXP or I'm fucking dealing with this shit. Okay. Is it another rock, dude? Oh, this is new. Uh, it's a fer Pharisee. Ah, shit. It's ground a versus steel grass type. Grass is strong against ground, though. If I remember my type typing correctly. It is. Shit. All right. It's four but times you know a week to fire. Yes. Hot Kong. It's a cool type combination, though. Oh, yeah. Can't do it. Oh, three damage on a crit? That sucks. Oh, another crit! <laughs> wow, you got really lucky. <coughs> you good? Oh, iron bars. Yeah. Oh, that hurt. that hurt more than you actually trying to attack me. You fool. All right. Oh, he's got a Munchlax. Yay! <laughs> oh, 
Oh, just a Jill tick? Okay, I'm gonna eat this guy really quick. I like how a small ass like tick can like somehow prevent Pokemon from eating berries. Why would it take you on? Maybe they're just humoring it. Yeah. Or do I want worry seed? I feel like I probably don't. Nah, I'm good. Oh, you finally are doing something besides using electric. Oh, Jesus Christ! Okay. <laughs> wow. I, they're tiny and yet they're dangerous. Like fucking uh, Kartana. I think I thought it was way smaller. It's still like four inches. I think they wanted to make it smaller. Or they wanted to make, like, the smallest Pokemon ever in this gen. It was gonna be an ant. But, uh, they couldn't get the go-ahead. To do ants, or just to do a small Pokemon? To do a Pokemon that small. Dude, you know what you could do if you wanted to do ants? You just have, like, a Pokemon that's just an army of ants that are just- that form, like, a- like, a humanoid-like person. Yeah. Ant -Man. Just, that- that would be, a, 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 like, a pun on Colony. It's like that one uh, weird uh, fighting type Pokemon that was just like a fucking uh, squad in Sword Shield. They did that with a uh, fish. They got wishy washy. Oh yeah, that was that, I like that as a concept. Oh my gosh, it's fine. I'm dun, dun, I'm dun 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 dun. dun. <laughs> Otacon, I'm pinned down. You are, un you are in unobser unobservant, my friend. Okay, what type? What what got? What uh, kind of trainer is that? That looks like a hiker. I think he's his ace trainer, which means he can oh. have anything. Shit. Okay. All right, ace. AC bait. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna save first. I'm in a good position too. I, I like partway into this cave. There's a doctor type trainer, who if you beat him will heal your Pokemon. I'm glad. Just if I want hard type. Oh, did you? You've heard that uh, that they have like a, uh, I think a roguelike uh, mod, a ROM hack for uh, one of the Pokemon games. You should try it out sometime. Uh, which one is that? I think Emerald. I'll have to, I'll have to look it up again. All right. I'm gonna test your resolve. I'm gonna see if you have what it takes. Oh yeah, same to you, guy. Archin, flying type. Ground has ground does jack shit against it. That's the bird that gives up after half its health. Oh cool. Well, I'll just I'll just eat it in a little. Dragon breath. Hmm. Dragon Breath is Dragon type, and Dragon type is strong against a lot of things. No, it's not. Oh. It's only super against Dragon type. Okay. Shit, I don't know. Hmm. Crook's gonna die next turn if he uses Dragon Breath again, and he's. Dragon Breath he's... is special. I don't have. Who's high against. Spe... I think that freaking then. Okay. Come on! Good. It's got Dragon Breath! I know. Oh, this time it used Acrobatics. Well. Oh, wow. <laughs> this here oh. is a dream Pokemon. Yeah. But... I just like the concept of like of like a Snorlax's dream because it's so big. It's its dreams are so powerful that it can manifest its dreams outside of like its reality. Is this the work of the DC Mini? <laughs> just it's just this fucking bunch of Snorlax's dream and up some weird shit. I I still think that's I think that's a rad idea. Yeah, no, that's fine. Uh, yeah, I get, now now I gotta do that for uh, that's uh, two down. Sorry, I guess four down. 
like and uh 140 something to go I'm gonna be real, this gen is already kind of just Gen 1, but slightly different in terms of the 150 Pokemon. Well, they're not remixing it, they're just creating new stuff and calling it, like, Halo. They're making new stuff, but heavily based on a lot of the Gen 1 concepts. The idea is to create, like, a Gen 1 except, uh, except strange and slightly more sinister. You got a Pikachu, who's the mascot of Pokemon, basically being the investigative force, being like, Hey, these Pokemon are all weird. Got a clink. What should you do with the come for you, a gang of of angry pigs? Oh, X attack, you cheater! Oh wow, I forgot. It's strong against dark for some reason. Until okay. next gen. Well, that okay. changes for some reason. Maybe they're like, okay, maybe you don't need steel to be so overpowered. Well, it's not really u useful offensively, so I guess they kind of tried to make it less... Just slightly less defensive and a little more useful offensively. They Hot burn. Kong has leveled up. Go to sleep. Yes, more attack! Okay, level 29. Your croc more has attack. to be close to evolving. I hope so. We'll find out in a sec. Just the one? Okay. Yes! 29, what a weird level. You're weird, Crocodile. Alright, what do you get? Oh, I forget what it's... I'll know in a sec, I guess. Da -da -da -da. Yeah, you're so cool. <laughs> Look at all that attitude. Is it is it just two or three? Uh, it's three. Okay, so, so it's got a third one to... Uh, kind of looks like a forward. Looney Tunes. That's modest. Modest, but intimidating. Yeah, I could kick your ass, I guess. Are you the one that can heal my Pokemon in the event I need it, dude? Nope. He's a si I'm a scientist, not a doctor! God damn it. Alright, fine. Sorry, Arceus, damn it. <laughs> Another fucking clink. Alright, well... You're still hurt, Crook. I don't want to, like... Just run! Fine. Okay, cool. Alright, what do we got here? A little revive. Okay, I, cool. I hate this fucking bird. There we go. Punch the bird. So, I don't think I've mentioned this to you, but, uh... I'm re-watching Hey Arnold, or I guess oh, watching no, through for the first time. You haven't mentioned that to me. Um, like that, you, you mentioned you were watching it, actually. I, I forgot about that. Um, Just because there's things yeah. that make it stand out from a lot of other Western cartoons. I remember it having a lot of heart. Yeah, it's... It's a, it's a very interesting show about, like, the life of, like, uh people living in the inner city. Which is still, like, the only kids' cartoon that was willing to do that. Have we have we ever gotten another one since then? Um... They're almost non-existent, right? That Loud House spinoff? Okay, I the spinoff, yeah. Maybe? That, I don't know. Yeah, the... the, the, the what about uh, the, uh... That, uh... Spanish... Or Mexican, uh, like, family? Proud that, family didn't live in the hood. The Boondocks, despite the title, lived in a nice suburban house, so I don't know what that was about. I mean... Did Coop even lived in a fucking suburb in, uh... 
It's just and, all suburbs. That's the only house allowed to ha exist in cartoons. Yeah, except then Hey Arnold came and it's like, hey, other places exist too. Uh, well, I, I, I knew, we, it, it's obvious, everyone knows how, like, uh, the, the whole Helga, you know, Sundere thing. I forgot just quite how obsessive she is. She makes Marinette look normal. Well, but Marinette di didn't go like, oh, Adrian, I love you. And then just sees that Adrian's like, oh, fuck you, Adrian. But right. yeah, you're right. She is. Like, she's got a, a shrine in the shape of Arnold's head in her closet yeah, made out of his discarded chew chewing gum. And at the same time, I guess it's like. She's uh, also not meant to be, like, as, as necessarily a likable character, though, like Marinette, I guess. Yeah, Marinette's meant to be likable. Uh, Helga's meant to be funny. It was Olga or Helga? I forget. No, it's Helga. Olga, Olga was the sister. Helga. I love you, and I hate you, and I love you, and I hate you! And a creepy guy in the background breathing like... <sighs> it's also really on the nose in that way, which, again, kids cartoon. Gotta spell it out for kids, <laughs> but... <laughs> I know, I know, I wasn't trying to make that joke. I know, it's... No, I, that actually happened in Hey Arnold. No, no, I, she, I know. She made that fucking line. She said that line, and then that one dude started heavily breathing right behind her. That was and a she, running gag. And rather than being creeped out, she just casually like, oh, this guy, and then punches him in, like, a comedic way. Because, you know, that's what you do to stalkers. You don't try to reason with them, because they don't, can't be reasoned with, I guess. I don't know. Mixed mix messages in that one. Data to prove that Clink existed more than a hundred years ago. Okay. You know that evil Knight Templars are in this cave, right? Maybe you should postpone this. Now, oh, this is a great time to go studying. They suddenly appeared a hundred years ago. Where Pokemon came from and where they are going. Where did they come from? Where did they go? Where did you come from? Pokemon Go. <laughs> Remember Pokemon Go? That sure existed. Yeah, it was a thing. It was one of the games of all time. I remember when that uh, person who was promoting Pokemon Go said, it's time to Pokemon Go outside and play Pokemon Go. And we Pokemon Go'd everywhere. There we go. I, I beat a dead meme. I'm never, probably never going to do that again. Eh. Yeah, can you heal my Pokemon? No? no? Okay. I'm a professor, not a doctor! I was talking to Bianca. I'm a bodyguard. Oh. I'm a bodyguard! <laughs> it would, would be funny for N to lie about, oh yeah, I beat her, I defeated her in a Pokemon battle, you see her, she doesn't even acknowledge it happened, which means either A, she just doesn't give a fuck, or B, he was lying. Oh, is that what he told you? <laughs> I had to throw her in the negative zone because he just, because... She disrespected gamers. Alright, how bad is this damage gonna be this time? Still bad. Fortunately, I can outspeed him. Why is. Crook's middle evolution looks so cool. He just has his arm crossed. He's like, fuck you gonna do? Got like that, uh, that 90s Sonic knockoff mascot attitude. <laughs> Crook the crocodile. It's it's not a it's not a it's not a platformer. It's a stealth game where you steal stuff. Yeah. You steal from the evil uh, evil C like uh, CEO uh, Gridalo. <coughs> I get I. I would say something. I don't have any other uh, funny uh, names for the guy, unfortunately. I need a doctor. Are there any more in here? I need a doctor. Oh, 
god, who's fighting me? Another one of you, huh? I'm getting... Oh, you're level 27 this time! Can we That's... just, like, step on it? Uh, no. We'll just... If we step on it, it'll probably give us a deadly shock. We, we should we should leave it alone. Alright, traveling south. Where's the doctor? Oh god, ninjas! No! Let's just South Park walk this way. Alright, the stairs. Team Plaza's waiting for you down there. Okay, uh... <laughs> Come! Well, I'm gonna go the... I'm actually gonna go the... Oh, shit. I think the doctor's close. This way or back the other way? No, the way you're going. Okay. Is the doctor nearby? <clears throat> Stupid fucking ninjas. It's Godfrey Ho ninjas. <laughs> they're gonna send they're gonna send like an evil Pokemon to deliver a message and then call you asking you if you got the evil Pokemon delivering the message. Hmm. Pokemon challenge. <laughs> still Oh man, I explained that several times on stream. I don't I, I don't want to again, just in case you Did you put that in the highlights yet? Uh, if it was in a video, I, I haven't got a clip of it or anything. Damn. I don't remember. <sighs> got right. Toxic. Do I want Toxic? Why am I Toxic? Oh, it's the doctor, thank God. Thank Arceus, I mean. <laughs> That's a scientist. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Are you a doctor? No, I'm a scientist. Shit! <laughs> you, you might be able to walk around this one. <laughs> nope, because there's another Joltik about to kick my ass. <sighs> Do I want it's toxic? toxic? Just an army of these fucks. Come on! This cave is just infested with ticks. You need to de louse after this. Okay. Wait, aren't you gonna fight me? No. Alright, is the scientist in the. Oh god, okay, sorry. I gotta run away from this Joltic fight really quick. <laughs> It's always Joltics. We ran away from all the boulders, and now all the all, the only people that want to fight us are Joltics. Imagine having an FOV of five degrees in real life. Um, it would, would suck. It would make life difficult. <laughs> then they then they gave everybody corrective uh, vision, and so in like later gens, uh. So, do I want to go down the stairs to see the doctor, or is it past the crystal I think, wall to the... I think there's, like, an item to the left, is all. Uh, I don't know what it is. Do I have a repel? Let me... I'm gonna... <laughs> I don't want to keep fighting shit. I, please let there be a repel. No. Please. Oh, god damn. Oh, yeah, you have one. I do, okay. I just, just the one, huh? Oh, two of them. That prevents weak wild Pokemon. So, Pokemon under your lead's current level. Okay, that's fine. Line's 30, so... <gasps> Wait. Those can oh, be, what? like, special encounters, or they can be items like the gem. Oh, Drillbur! Oh, hello! All right, well, if you survive this, I will catch you. How's that sound, Drillber? Yep. Don't think it's gonna survive that. Nope. Sorry, you're, uh, you're out. Last time it was an item. That's why I was like, okay. Okay, twins. Okay, I'm going north, because I don't want to fight twins. Doctor! There he is! There's the doctor! Doctor! I want you to help me out! 
Of course! Really? If you beat me in a Pokemon battle... Oh god. I've taught the Hippocratic Oath! I've taught all the Hippocratic Oath! You want the treatment? You beat me in battle! I went army there for a second. The Hippopotocratic Oath. If you like, I will make your Pokemon healthy. <laughs> it's literally that! I knew it! <laughs> How do you think I felt when this class appeared in later games and don't heal you anymore? Oh, piss. Oh, that's just a grass type. This will be easy. Just gotta punch it. Just hang out in fucking caves. Like they're in Sword and Shield, just doctors and nurses stand around outside like assholes. They don't heal you. Some of them do. What? Did my Pokemon lose energy? I promise! Make your Pokemon healthy! Jack, you gotta either commit to the bit or don't do it. Okay. okay. Alright, so this guy... I was gonna set waypoints. Like, mark and recall. Like in Morrowind. That'd be cool. Just come back here if I need to. Put a pin on my map. Renegade! Oh, it's an electric Giratina. That's why it's here. We're the renegades of, of uh, Funk. I think there are, like, themes to the area still. Like, it tries to put Pokemon of similar types in the in a same spot. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so... Alright, I guess I'm fighting the twins. They don't have to. They're not in your way. But I must. I apologize, but I, something tells me that, that I can't let this lie down. Alright, twins. The We're the Nugget, Nugget Brothers. Brothers. <laughs> We're gonna it. give you special powers! I'm the little brother. I'm gonna give you this. Oh! oh. <laughs> I didn't talk to them because I thought they were trainers! <laughs> Free money, cool. <laughs> what the fuck is that? Who just Come stands back. around giving out free money? Maybe they're ghosts. <laughs> they died here. Forget about it. Nice. Oh no, repel's gone. I gotta, I gotta fight normally now. The encounter rate feels, like, ridiculously high in this cave. It always feels high in caves. It's always just dumb. It's a stupid high, like, like encounter rate. It's a good thing Crook is, like, fast, though. I can just run away. Oh, my God! Let me get out of the fucking ca What the fuck? What are you? So, this has a final evolution that knows met le levitate. So, it technically has no weaknesses as an electric type with meditate. I'm sorry, Ooh. levitate. Ooh. Yeah. I want them. If it's electric type, it's not gonna hurt me, so I can take my time uh, with it. Oh, oh it's levit levitate. Alright. Hope you survived this. Chomp. You did, good. Alright. Yeah, you feel submissive? Feel feel like you wanna you wanna join me now? Here, Pokeball. <laughs> wow, that's rare. Or maybe it's just at the end of the cave. Oh so no! Oh so it, why does it move so violently? This Venomoth is freaking out! It's... Does it always do that? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> That's intimidating. <laughs> Just... <laughs> it's like, it's like a, it's like a fucking method. <laughs> wow, the butter, the cave Butterfree was way calmer. <laughs> cave Venomoth is scary as shit. I kind of want it. <laughs> do it. When one alone doesn't have much power, a chain of any Tynamo can be as powerful as lightning. Mouth of the 
god dang old Porky's butthole. Was it that one guy who like called in to like uh, the Matt Judge and said, and that's what he called the show? I, th I, th the story I was told is that he was making a complaint about, like that's what he thought the title of Beavis and Butthead was. Oh yeah, that he misheard the title or something, which yeah, and... then became the inspiration for the Boomhauer voice in King of the Hill, which is a good voice, I have to admit. Boom Hour! Yo, man. <laughs> but you know what, what's funny is that they made Boom Hour like one of the uh, more moral characters in the show. Yeah. Could have been a lot worse. Like, like, like uh, Hank is kind of like run of the mill kind of guy who tries his best, but he still, he still is, just doesn't understand certain things. But he tries to understand. Uh, Do I look like I know what a JPEG is? Got uh, Dale Gribble, who's the conspiracy theorist, who, despite being like a crazy conspiracy theorist, actually is like a good father to to his uh, kid. And I do consider him his kid, considering that he actually raised him instead of like the other guy who just wasn't really present in, in his life. Yeah, the Native American dude. Yeah, John Redcorn. And then, uh, and then Bill. you have. Bill. Poor Bill. <laughs> Bill, out, out of the forum, he's got the roughest deal. He just kind of falls for everything. Yeah. He just, he's not good with the uh, women. He's just... it's it's kind of sucks. And then, you got Boomhauer, and he, he fucking, like, rocks a, like a leopard print, like, thong. He has, like, a hot tub. He's, like, the coolest dude out of all of them, and I, I don't think... Like, he has... He's the he's the Gary Stu of like the of like the crew. Yeah. <laughs> let's make a, a king of the whole king of the hill uh, tier king list. Let's, let's rank <laughs> power levels. It Boomhauer's king of the hole. Boomhauer is the character you unlock who's broken in competitive play. <laughs> let's put it like that. I. Uh... Oh no! You know he does have a weakness. He talks like that. Yeah. Yo, man, we just he. <laughs> I would, then again, it, it all adds to his charm, so it's not really a weakness. I watched He's a bit. Go on. Yeah, no, you, sorry, you go on. I, 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 no, I was going to change the sub subject if you're done with Boomhauer. Yeah, okay, go for it. I watched a, a video of the use of Giga Bowser competitively in Melee. Oh, really? Which has only been allowed a couple times because apparently he is, like, totally game breaking top three. However, oh, he's garbage in Ultimate. He's like the worst character in the game. It is just weird to see him how differently he performs in the different engines. That, that's. But uh, there was talk of there's like one player who is known for labbing him and was allowed to pull him out at an event like twice. A lot of people rage quit. <laughs> and he tried to convince the developers of Slippy to allow Bowser, Giga Bowser online on April 1st every year. I don't know if they went through with it or not. Well, I mean, it's April 1st. It's just, if it's just one day, it's not like it's gonna... Yeah, I finally got Drillver. Good job. Well, I, I just, I did hit him with a fire punch full blast. <laughs> I think I just, it'd be cool to have the wire flame, the wire frames on uh, Slippy's character select because they're just strictly worse characters. Oh yeah! If you want to challenge yourself, you just play as Wireframe. Believe it or not, there are people who lab the uh, wireframes in Melee. And what, what do they find? Is it any broken? Uh, they have some things good about them, but they're mostly garbage.
So if you really want to like like uh, own somebody, you just play as a as a uh, wireframe dude. Yeah. And you beat him with it. And that doesn't just deal like normal damage; it deals psychic damage. But they don't have any special moves. They don't have recoveries even. Another clink, huh? I was really hoping that there was a second doctor in this cave, but I haven't found one. Good to know, no second doctor. Huh? <laughs> you know what game I liked? Chrono Trigger. You know why? Because it didn't do random encounters. It had the encounters easily, like, like in certain places. And if you didn't want to fight them, you could just run around them. Why the fuck is this cave full of legendaries? <laughs> I'm, you, this is the total, this is the complete definition of you picked the wrong house, fool. These are the uh, these are the weird, like weather legendaries that we probably won't see in this game because I think they're post game. Am I going in fucking circles? <laughs> Going is this going to be the entire stream? Is this fucking cave? <laughs> That's going to be the title of the stream, is this fucking cave. Except we're going to have to censor it so YouTube doesn't shadow ban us. Oh, wait. Oh. Still pissed. I pursued him to death. I, I wish shadow banning was like an actual thing that we can... Like, like prove? Just tell, well, prove and also have like a way to dispute it. Being like, hey, we're not going to do this again. How can we... How can we let it so that your algorithm doesn't like doesn't like give a shit? At this rate, we might just have to start our own channels and then just like try again. I mean, it's kind of we're just kind of doing the same thing that a lot of people are doing. I, I don't think it's like a shadow ban thing. I think it's just. I think it happened with the stuff we did in the past. I don't want to really talk about it on stream, but I. Well, I, the highlights channel is a brand new channel. Oh, yeah. And that that's also been, doesn't really get a lot of views. I wonder if it's because it's a they, they know where it's adjacent to us or something. I don't know. I don't think that's it. Conspiracy theories. Jesse Ventura, is this how how is this conspiracy? Like YouTube is is full of P of like variety streamers with no views, unfortunately. Unfortunately. Let's shout in the void. It's fine though. Okay. Oh, I just went in a circle. How the fuck did I, I end up what? back here? This cave fucking sucks. This sucks. I I hate this fucking cave. At least I'll meet the doctor again. It's you know what happens? It's all these like it's all these random encounters. You know what these random encounters do? They make you Temporarily forget. Hey, there's a doctor up there. You see what we're no, seeing? No, a scientist. Okay, never mind. I am a hiker. I will teach you the harshness of life and the difficulty of a This life. cave does not need more harshness. <laughs> it's already harsh. It's harsher than a bomb rip from some really shit weed, okay? Like, just. You ever notice <laughs> that uh, Arnold and Gerald. Kind of look like a doobie in a bong. <laughs> oh, I say nothing. No, no. <laughs> they do though. <laughs> Not another one of these bull tours. God damn it! <laughs> I'm going mad. I am going delirious again. Do you have an item that lowers encounters? <laughs> like, no, this uh, is a traitor battle. Oh. This is a fucking traitor battle. I gotta well, you didn't have to shit. talk to this guy. Have you been saving? Yes, I saved when I first encountered the doctor. It's not like I lost a whole lot of progress. I'm just. What, where am I gonna be? I'm gonna reload. I'm still gonna be in the fucking cave. Oh, yeah. SmackDown. I guess what? I got Musashi. I'm just gonna fucking razor shell you, dick. What? You avoided it! Oh, jeez. Okay. 
Hit your razor shell this time, please. What? <laughs> How is this guy dodging all my shit? You lucky fuck. Wait, we just Wait. we just both took the same path, didn't we? Unless you went backwards. What? <laughs> One HP. Oh, it's sturdy. That. Okay, so Ugh. from the doctor, I went up through a, a smorgasbord of plasma dudes. I hate this. I hate this. Yeah. I. Uh. But Jack, this is the best generation. This is everyone's favorite. The greatest generation. Did it serve in World War Two? You don't get it, do you? Okay, no, I, I get, get it. it. What what okay. war did Bill serve in? Vietnam? Uh, yeah. If it was, uh, yeah, Vietnam. Girder's fighting type, psychic type. Or is it fighting type? Yeah. Okay, yeah. <sighs> Go deeper into the cave. Suffer I... in the cave. I took the stairs up because I thought that was the way out. Silly me. Right, I gotta see the doctor. Fortunately, I know where he is. Yeah, take a hike, asshole. Alright. Sharpen? How can this bird be any sharper? Hey, points get dull. Oh, god damn it. Uh... <laughs> Jack, sit, check your inventory for a for a. I I like don't, a I cleanse got, tag. Oh, it's cleanse. Oh yeah, cleanse tag's a thing. I forgot. Do I have a cleanse tag? Maybe one of your Pokemon's holding it. Oh, no! One of them has a smoke bomb. I think. What do, what item do you have? Oh, you got a rocky helmet. You you should keep that. Oh, Eevee like could raise the defense of one of your Pokemon that's not fully evolved. Uh, okay, I don't see a. Oh, I guess you don't have one. Or it might be in like on a Pokemon in a box. Yeah, Smoke Ball, which guarantees escape, but you haven't like failed to escape yet, have you? No, Crook's Crook's speed. I think got the highest speed out of all my Pokemon. Also, can also everything here is kind of sluggish. This is guy's speed. Yeah, speed's fifty six. It's well, actually, I guess it could be faster. I don't know who's, who's the fastest. Is or right, you know what? You know what? You you go. Item. Give. Smoke ball. Where's smoke ball? What does uh what does the crocodile have? Uh the lucky egg. Smoke ball. It's fine, because it's fire. It's smoke, it makes sense. Oh my oh. god. Three when attack. You... What? I was trying to think when you're uh when you're buff dude evolves, because normally it's a trade evolution, but we have that disabled in the randomizer equivalent. Yeah, you're running away. Okay. Okay. Across the bridge. Run away. I... This fucking bolt horse. <laughs> These things are aggravating to fight. <laughs> I tried using a water type against it and missed its razor shell every single time, except except for the last time, and then it sturdied its way out of it. Fuck these guys. Uh, level 37. Okay. Oh no, I'm too nervous to eat berries. Better run. I- that was literally two moves, come on! <laughs> and, 
is this fucking cave? Okay. Thank you. <clears throat> what was that, like two steps? This is getting more annoying. Oh shit! I forgot I didn't fight this one. Okay. I love this place! Don't you love this place? You're a masochist. I'm not going to enjoy this, but you- Oh, it's a clink? Okay, I can just punch it and it's dead. It's level 29, too. Probably a decent chunk of EXP. Fire punch. Oh, wow! X special, huh? Well, guess what? You, you fucking masochist. Get, get out of my life. <laughs> oh, look, another bull door. It does, like, this feels worse than Gen 1. The encounter rates are just off the charts in this cave. I'm gonna blame Team Plasma. Yeah. Oh, wait, there's nothing down here. Shit. They're, they're stirring up the Pokemon. Wait. Oh, I just found a Master Ball. Neat. Uh. So. Do I have to go up? Wait, but... The rocks only move if they're magnetically drawn to one of the big rocks. So you can only push them towards one of the big ones. Why does this bird have a flaming foot? But it didn't what the it, fuck like, is uh... V-Create? Oh yeah, v v Vicini uses it in, uh... In, uh... I've seen it used in, uh... Competitive? Yeah. Let me leave this bird! Let me... Well, I can only move it once, huh? There's nothing further south from... Oh, I gotta go inside the fucking stairs, I guess. This is back around to the doctor. I'm pretty sure I'm going the right way, but... Jesus, this cave is long. Hello, Gleam. Base Gleam 180 right. fire move. Well, it's probably not base 180 in this version. Oh, it's learned by... Why does why does Rayquaza learn it? What? Because it is the progenitor Pokemon of all things. I guess. But it's not. What? Who is the creator Pokemon? Is it Mew or is it fucking Arceus? Something between the two. I said Rayquaza, though. Wait... Is Mew Pokemon Satan? Hmm. If it's, like, supposed to be, like, an asshole. Oh, hello. You're just hanging out in here? I guess it's easy enough to theorize that, uh, like, the, the Sinnoh creation myth is Arceus, and then you've got time, space, antimatter, and the three floating things are, like, the beings of emotion or something spirit i, I they're they're kind of similar to mew right yeah you could slot was... in with them somehow you got to go past the plasma guys up north sorry there's no way around it what do, who do the plasma guys usually use what are uh... their uh what are their oh okay yeah i don't remember I, mean, I should have kind of like uh, taken a polaroid of them using their pokemon and then writing it down How are you doing, Gleam? We've spent the entire stream in Charged Stone Cave. We hate it here! Uh, 
No, don't call it Charge Some Kid. Call it by its proper name. Uh, what's its proper name? This fucking cave. <laughs> If we swore less, we'd be we'd be like better on YouTube. Yeah, nah, I, I don't it. think so. I don't. I don't. I mean, market to kids, but no. But we would trust us if we did because of our because of our past. We're I'm not gonna lie and say we're some we're people or not. Steel Rock Boundary Pokemon. This Pokemon has healthy boundaries. Yeah, this is, it enforces it by uh, two defensive types. You you came here because somebody manipulated you. Okay. That sounds like a conversation starter from a healthy individual. Three. Sandile. Oh yeah, dark type. Okay, dark ground. Oh, Musashi. Okay, I'll, I'll use some. I'm bigger than you! I'm you, but better. Oh, I am reminded of a SCP, uh, uh, like, article I read that I found kind of funny. Yeah? It involved the Dodos being, like, an SCP. Like, the Dodos were considered extinct, but the SCP Foundation has, like, the last of them. And so they kept them, they keep them alive because if there's only like one left then bad things happen and okay. but the dodos they have their like intelligent they have their own like language and stuff and one scientist comes and starts speaking their lady their uh, language and the dodo responds back silence peasant what makes you think you can talk to me to your betters that way and then he <laughs> the scientist simply goes i am taller than you and <laughs> the dodo grumbles like okay and he's like okay i got questions for you and he's like what makes you think I'll give you your, those questions? And then the scientist goes, I weigh heavier than you. And he's like, and the daughter's like, well, my apologies. <laughs> I don't know why I find that so funny. God. Just, telling, just telling a bird, I'm taller than you. And he's like, okay, fair enough. <laughs> Every fucking two steps. Why do they jack up the encounter rates in caves? Like, maybe they're afraid that they'd, they'd be like, they pass through them so quickly and they'd miss everything. So it's probably like, okay. the same encounter rates as in, like, grass. The difference is it's literally every tile. Scraggy is dark fighting. Yes. Dark is strong against fighting. Uh, other way around. Okay, buggy, come on out. Kick a ghost. That yeah, was probably not a ghost. Yep, you're dead. Oh wow, he's on the cusp of leveling up. Yep. Wait, wait. oh, is he learning? Bulk up! Okay, what does that do? Raise attack and defense, I think? Oh! Uh... Probably better in focus energy. Yeah. or just Watchog. Oh, that's a normal type. Okay, I'll keep battling. Is this like the least cute Pokemon? It looks like a Looney Tune, kind of. Or like, sorry, a, a, like a Woody Woodpecker. Yeah. Okay. Oh, you just hypnosis shit! Apparently, Woody got, like, a lot tamer over his life. Like, he was what, really wait. raunchy early on. Oh, raunchy. Okay, I thought you meant, like, he was, like, killing people, like, robbing banks and shit. Yeah, GTA, <laughs> Woody Woodpecker, motherfucker. <laughs> oh, man. <sighs> but he got I... toned down so much over the course of his life that a lot of people just found it boring by the end. I bet. <sighs> Remember when uh, Disney and uh, 
in like uh, Looney Tunes, they were in the same movie together. Yeah. You know how they were in the same movie together? You know what like what like uh, agreement was reached? That they had to have exactly the same amount of camera time. Yeah, which is why you have uh, Donald Duck and uh, Daffy Duck just playing piano together, and then the scene where both Bugs and Mickey were just falling like with a parachute on their back. It's like, hey, give them the spare. And yet Disney like continued to own the rights to the movie, and I think owns it to this day. What we need is a death battle between Bugs Bunny and uh, Mickey Mouse. Yeah. Settle the score once and for all. Well, Bugs Bunny is probably A, done more stuff, and B, has a personality. Mickey is just kind of like the John Cena of the uh, of the cartoon world, in that he's like generic good guy with like kind of like no real personality other than I'm gonna rise above up, above hate and be like the best guy. Whereas his early personality was like more interesting and kind of a dick. He's just kind of the everyman. Is Mickey? Yeah, which is John Cena. So. And Bugs Bunny is, like, the more interesting character because he's always been consistently, like, a wise guy. Which, Bugs wasn't originally, like, the Looney Tunes poster child. He came after Daffy. Daffy was originally, like, a better... Was, like, sorry, not better. He was just a, like... He was, he was a wackier a character. He was screwball, he was, yeah. He was wackier than Bugs. Bugs was more manipulative and cunning. And then, I guess, da Daffy had, like, a heel turn and he became, like, the, uh... The put upon dude who was possibly the, the victim of Bugs's jokes. He was rewritten to be more of a foil to Bugs after Bugs happened. Yeah. Which you know, like imagine being like the white bread baby face, and then another wrestler debuts after you, and then you have to be like the the heel to like be the foil to uh, the top face. Hey, I'm Ditto. Hmm, can I use that? Maybe I'm fast enough to put it to sleep. Yeah. Oops. There was a recent Ditto event in Scarlet and Violet for Easter. There were five EV, IV Ditto raids. Huh. Surprised people are still playing that game despite the fact that like all their save people's save data becomes is becoming corrupted. Have they fixed the issue yet? I don't know that they ever found the issue. Gleam. Oh no. I, I got Trump Card, which is a move that gets stronger if it has less PP, but it has 35 PP now. Look, I like the Pokemon. I enjoy it so much. I'll give you my card if you want to you if you want to call me, and I will help you out. I'm good. I, I don't. I don't need that card. He's been arrested, by the way. Yeah, has he? Yeah, like he, he's in custody. He's he's being. He, He's like, yeah, he's like going to trial and shit. I, well, I know he's, he's going to. There's people trying to get him to trial, but no, he's he's like he's like threatening jurors and shit. It's like it's like he's gonna Trump's got to Trump no matter no matter what, I guess. Come to the conclusion that the people that were affected had hacked switches. Hmm. Hacked switches. <laughs> There's been no further <laughs> cases of it happening. Well, that's good. Okay, well, I guess I can play Scarlet Violet for real this time. Ah, he's still confused even while he's asleep. Come on, just one more hit. Oh my god, come on. There we go. I am, go. I'm guessing that like the other, Ed, were you able to get more than one 5 IV ditto gleam? Or was it just one and done? Probably I can't one. believe I lost. All right, now that was annoying. Tell me the secret. Getsis of the Seven Sages supports our king. I guess he's talking about in, and Getsis has three subordinates. The Shadow Triad. Oh, the ninjas! I have like 20 of them. Oh, that's good. If I ever resume playing the game, I would like to have one. But, uh... I, I just kind of haven't. 
ended up with two perfect 6 IV Spanish dittos. Ooh. If I win against you, release your Pokemon. So, no. the path that I was so sure was the way to go was a dead end. However, I just randomly stumbled into this fuck, so I guess I went the right way. Just a Scraggy, huh? Just, just the one? Oh, he's still asleep. That's fine. Was he not asleep? Played through Scarlet in Spanish. I did not know you did that. Just because you wanted, like, different... a different version ditto? I just wanted to... I thought it was just, like, to get immersed in, like, the, uh, the world. If you have a ditto from another region, then if you... Well, if you breed two Pokémon from different regions, you have a better chance of getting a shiny. Oh, that's, inter that's actually interesting. I just... <laughs> I, I... Okay, come on. Let's run away. The trainer's just trying his best, but he keeps like, tripping on rocks every two steps. God damn it. Okay, let's fight. They're so beautiful, if you say so. Because they are free from people, if you say so. They're dicks and they all deserve to die. Hey, uh, Fred, you ever think maybe we should uh, start over? Like, start from zero? <laughs> you, you saw that video too, that was great. It was the, old, the second time they, uh, they that he did that, that uh, friends, like a Fred Flintstones uh, video, like a uh, cartoon. And I was just like, Okay, see you later, Gleam. Oh, it's your phone. Oh, please don't let it be. Okay. Well, I'm glad this did end up working. Oh, yeah. We, were, we tried we were to. You, you're in your own new place and you got, like, new internet. And we were worried because Discord was already taking up, like, most of the bandwidth. Yeah, but for some reason, Parsec doesn't, so... Despite Parsec transferring button inputs and video, and Discord only transmitting audio. I don't know, maybe maybe the uh, speed test site was wrong. Like, it could be wrong. Reflect type, what? I didn't even know that was a move. Not very effective. Wake up! Ah. Level 30. Yes, more attack. I'm, I'm it's my swole buddy. It just keep it, it can't do anything except keep changing its type to be me. All right, well, my type is now your type. Yeah, well, my type's I now your got type. A type. Bad moons are the only kind I like. You're the trainer that Lord Den is worried about. Let's fight. Okay, fighting another Trubbish. Your team is Trubbish. Alright, time to eat. Mario, I bake an, baked an absolute Trubbish cake. Just absolutely mucked it up. Do not come that, to the castle. It's code, that means she wants me to come to the castle. Another Trubbish. You know what, I'm gonna switch to my Psychic type this time. What is this Ice Vulture? I don't like it. <laughs> Go to sleep. Oh no, this is weird. Oh, you know, takedown, that's cool. It's kind of ironic that this is the gen that the trash Pokemon was introduced, because this is the gen where poison still sucked. 
You see that poison is trash. Okay, cool. Higher special attack. Nice to know. Another trophy. I'm gonna double down on my strategy. Sorry. Psychic powers are good against garbage. Oh, it's stockpiling now. Oh, you're gonna raise your defense. That's cute. You thought that that would work. Alright, time to heal. So it seems like once you get through this plethora of, of grunts, you are more or less done. Yeah, you mean you mean with the stream? It, yeah, <laughs> I agree. <laughs> this cave sucks. This cave sucks. Imagine we like ended the last stream like, oh, let's just get to the next town. How long could it take? I mean, like. The difference between uh, between caves and the overworld is that with the overworld, you know where kind of where the encounters are going to be. Whereas I was literally in that cave for half a year. Go deeper into your cave. Shut up, Ben. I'm not interested. Trubbish is cute, though. To gleam, it's garbage with googly eyes. Well, it's got ears, too. Also, I agree. Tru Trubbish has a really cute design. I have someone with hidden power. Who do I got? Uh, Dragonair has hidden power. Dark. Oh, okay. I should buy some more balls. In fact, I'm gonna buy Ultra Balls. All right. Moment of truth. Let's see what's in my PC. What what wacky new things did I get? I haven't been able to look for a while. No, not this thing again. Uh, hypnosis. I got a requate. When I get a requaza, requaza. It's sticky. It's got a sticky hold. Hypnosis. Electric type, it's a special attacker, low speed well, though. Well, it's a good thing I, I have Sand Tomb, that way when, while I'm like waiting for my guy to wake up, I can just still deal damage. Oh, you're using Confuse Ray too, it's cool. Reggie Steel is a flying rock. Low attack, got special attack though. Oh, Super Fang, I forgot that that was a thing. Okay, you know what? Also, no special defense. Where did its stats go? Reggie Rock is a dragon, as we found out. All with attack. Huge attack power. Hmm. Kind of like that. Uh, no defense, though. Huge attack, no defense, no special defense, no speed. What a weird stat spread. Electric Giratina. Special attack. Also low defenses. All of my Pokemon are just glass cannons. Yep. And 
then the Steel Rock special attacker, even the worst special defense so far. I kind of like the Reggie Rock. What are my party Pokemon look like? What are their attack stats? That was a new. Still two more. I gotta go back to the fucking doctor. Yeah. Not a lot. Dragon Dragoner's attack kind of sucks. And I'm using a physical attack for it? Why am I using this thing? Uh, I mean, perhaps if you perhaps if you tattooed on your body like your ideal Pokemon setup, yeah. you would have been able to remember. <laughs> 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 <sighs> Kadabra's got a nice immunity, at least. I'm gonna replace Dragonair. Dragonair sucks. Yep, another fucking Pokemon. Jack, you're I'm... so cl you're almost done. I know. This, this, this is, the fact that I'm almost done is making this more painful. It's just every please, no more. <laughs> Let me see if I got any cool, uh, cool TMs. Dragonair is such a good looking mon. I like Dragonair as a Pokemon, just not this Dragonair. This randomized Dragonair is kind of doo doo. Uh. Let's see. Lunar Dance. Eh. Flash, Dragon Dance. I'll give it okay, swift. Let's fucking fight. The hope of Team Plasma. Come on. Oh, dark type. Okay, cool. Let's let me slap it. Wait, is this the right one? Oh, no, it was the other one that was the special attacker. Regirock is the high attack one. Yeah, ow, ow, ah. Back bothering you? No, my, my jaw cramped up when I yawned. Back's been pretty decent. It's, it's been my fingers lately. Well, it's been my fingers for the past, like, year and a half. Maybe before that, when we were still together, living together... Uh, was I ever complaining about my fingers? Uh, now and again, when we were talking about streaming a game or something. Okay. Yeah, I, I yeah, it might be arthritis. I have to get that checked out by my doctor. Dragon, yeah, you know, let's see if my, uh, my rock can dragon dance. That seemed like a good idea. I'll do that. Dragon Dance and Baton Pass. Just steam all of these fools. They're kind of schmucks. They're just kind of, this is a lot of tedium, not difficulty, this cave. The Watchdog is the is the one that's like the most annoying because Hypnosis! That was Hypnosis. What? No, the sleepy boy technique is a legitimate fighting technique. <laughs> that else never failed to make me laugh when the guy was like getting his ass kicked and crying and suddenly he claps and the other guy's like all hurt and he's like, What happened? I was beating you and he just goes, That was hypnosis. 
just like why was this Bucky. uh that was a uh, grant fish the guy we call grant fisher what's his dorio dorian i think dorian dorian versus a good karate hotshot yeah yeah, he was like beating the sh like Karate Hotshot was beating the shit out of him, and then almost time. Fuck it, let's go. Let's Save. Go. You're going up, and then at the branch, you're gonna go right, and that's the exit. Do I have to fight in? There may be an end fight. Okay, well, I'm gonna kick his ass. Might, might be an end boss. Uh, no! No! Are you fast enough to flee a bug? Many different values mixed together. And the world becomes gray. That is unforgivable! I will separate Pokemon and people, and black and white will be clearly distinct. Hey, we got a title drop. Only then will Pokemon become perfect beings. <laughs> Sir, your plan makes no sense. Why do people like this guy? He's got big Sime energy, I guess. That is a dream I must fulfill! No! As if a person without a dream could ever understand me! Buddy, I got a lot of bad dreams. You want me to share some of them? I guess I have to crush your will here. Does this guy ever, like, have a face heal turn? Do we have to, like, fucking kill him? I see a face now? No, does he ever have a heal face turn, or do I have to kill him? Yeah. To be pretty... Yeah, we, we, the end game ends when we stab him in the throat. No, maybe he just chooses to stay in, like, another dimension and sealed, and that's, like, pretty much... Okay, come on. Oh, All you're right. gonna do... N, you're supposed to leave this game, but you're still harassing me. We're gonna do another fight. Loser leaves this dimension. <laughs> See, I told you it's a good idea! <laughs> oh, he's got- he's sturdy. Damn it. Alright. Oh, you're just gonna defend again? You idiot! Alright, well... Do you believe that Pokémon battles help us understand each other? Yeah, I understand you. you. You- you're afraid to take risks because you just keep defending with your fucking, uh, stone guy. Joltik. Okay. This, is, this will be easy. Quirk. Oh no, I'm too nervous to eat berries, but on the other hand, your attack goes down! Yay! Alright. Fight. Oh, hey, cool, you actually used a move that's, like, super effective against me. That's cool. I'm still faster than you. You're slightly smarter than every other trainer in the game. See, I'm learning about you. For Pokemon Battles, help us learn about each other. No! Poke, this is not the way Pokemon are meant to be! This is not the way we should be acting. <laughs> Just because it's too formal for somebody doing heinous shit is the thing. Just, like... I got rollout. It's not as broken as the previous iteration, but it's still not bad. 75 starting power. Who do I want to give it to? 91. Oh, Clink, that's it. This is how you end your battle. You just this is all Pokemon you caught in this fucking Dude. You suck. Oh, you avoided. Okay. Oh. Oh, that's it. All right. Fire punch. This time it hits. K. 
Okay, are you done yet? Thank you. My friend's getting hurt. That is what a Pokemon battle is. Why? Is it possible for me to win while feeling bad about being a trainer? <laughs> Dude. So if I can pursue my ideals with something as meaningless as a battle. As if that could make me worthy to become friends with a legendary Pokemon. Hey, J. Cool! Just a little further! Oh, it's you! What is this- I, what is this Android 19 theme song he's got, by the way? Oh, yeah. Hey, who's this? Professor Juniper, what are you thinking? You have no qualms about the relationship between Pokemon and the people? But Pokemon in categories using arbitrary rules and think you can understand them like that. No, they're not arbitrary. This is, this is very proven science. That there's grass type, there's rock type. Quiet! What do you have to say for yourself? Who are you? Looks like you're not my biggest fan. <laughs> eh, happens to be different from mine. Yeah, understandable. How about if all people get to decide for themselves how to relate to Pokemon? She's saying I should just allow people to think whatever they want and treat Pokemon however they want, no matter whether the Pokemon suffer. I, I didn't say that. <laughs> We're just treating him. But well, he is a oh. joke. <laughs> didn't expect him to change his mind right away. He's Puckles got that little... mid, like, he's got that naughty's angst that just doesn't age well. Crawling in my crawl, these crawls will not crawl. He's, crawling. Yes, he's very crawling. He's like the he's like the Sephiroth of Pokemon. <laughs> Except not as cool. <laughs> Sephiroth Final Fantasy VII except as Pokemon. First off, Ares wouldn't die. Sorry, spoilers. Or Aerith, sorry, again. Uh, second off, uh... What was I, what was I thinking? Second off, a Sephiroth just, like... I had the genes of a Pokémon inside. Thank God we're out of that fucking nightmare cave. What's the encounter rate of this cave? Hi? This should be set to low, or none. Use bushes except in caves, please. Alright, I'm saving. I'm done with this game for now. Oh, that that's it? In... Wait, how long have we been going? Uh, how long have we been going? Hour 50. Only an hour 50?! We're gonna go that a little like, longer, can't we? For like three hours. Oh, let's get going. Fine. Uh. But how come I can't? Oh, these are different from the other. These aren't bike paths or balance beams. You can't balance on a balance beam with a bike. That's silly. Only in Hoenn. Only that trainer's cool enough. Oh, hey, Jay. Cool. Yep. You were stuck in that cave. Yes, we were stuck in that cave for two hours, Gleam. That's so... It, it was bad. I honestly did not remember the cave being that bad. Upgrade my Pokedex. What does it do now? Now it shows forms. Okay. Who's that Who are you? Skyla, huh? Guess we'll do the gym and then... And then that's it. What the fuck? The growl roared at me. Oh, so that that was the lady professor's dad, I guess. I guess. I need to take care of something first. 
I was flying a cargo plane and I saw something on top of the Celestial Tower. Guess we're doing the Celestial Tower next. It's a sick Pokemon! What is it with all these sick Pokemon on top of towers? Are they fucking princesses? We gotta climb another tower. This is gonna be another fucking annoying ass dungeon. Oh, you piece of shit. For alligator aftermath. Alright, is there a. Uh... Is it, is it up north? It is up north. There's a brief route. Fortunately, you can avoid pretty much everything on the balance beams, I think. I need to train, though, I guess. Cause the tower... What uh, Pokemon are in the tower? Uh, it's It's got dragon Pokemon. What's... I don't have any ice types. What's strong against dragon? It's ice and ice and dragon. God damn it! You got you got any rock moves? Uh, Buggy's got rock throw. That's pretty much it. A dino in the grass is best training. Hey, you gotta like wait until rustling grass appears though. Oh, you're not a. I have to brute force it. The tower will be fine. I would remember being a brief detour is all. Might have ghosts in it, actually. That's that's better. I got a psychic type. I think it has mostly ghosts and one dragon. Actually, wait, no. Psychic isn't strong against ghosts. It's worth it. Wait the 30 seconds. Oh, is it like real-time seconds? Wait, 30 seconds? For... You get rustling grass, and the most common Pokemon to appear in rustling grass that's, like, everywhere is the Chansey equivalent of this game. Which is worth a lot of EXP, I guess. Yeah, comparatively. Okay. Alright! Smith Sage? That's... grass, right? Yes. Okay. Hot Kong. Hot, 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 hot. Oh wow, that guy looks rad. Looks like a parody character. He kind of looks like Space Dandy. He looks like he looks like if Maxi from Soul Calibur was a monkey. Yeah. I got a choice band. Three real time seconds, huh? All right. Well, I'm waiting. You have to be mo Yeah, that's what I thought. I always ran around until the grass started shaking. Damn it. Okay. Oh, it's a uh, autumn de winter deerling? I already got a deerling though. Which means that's bad news for you. I'm going to run away. No, I can't get away. It's too fast. Fucking orange right. hatted. You want to play? Fine, let's play. Rock throw. You know you're just hurting yourself more than you're hurting me, right? Director Marcellus has a far fetched. Marcellus Wallace? Somebody once tried to give his Pokemon a foot massage, and then he did a seismic toss uh, through, uh, through his trainer's Pokemon through four stories. And there was a well, fell through like a glass, and he threw that. Since then, his uh, the Pokemon's nature has been more modest. Damn it's shame. Even worse, start far fetched. A slow start. <laughs> hey, an Ultra Ball. That'd be useful. Okay. Move around for thirty seconds. If you move around for thirty seconds, you'll see a spot of shaking grass, and that's where the Audinos usually appear. You probably don't need to be grinding, but... I... don't... trust... There's also a chance that you, like, 
get an encounter on your way to the Shaking Grass. Yay! No! Like <laughs> Son of a bitch. Wait. Oh! It's the Snot Bear. That's, that's Ice Type. I can use him. You're coming with me, buddy. Oh, that's Rock Throw. Shit. I should have used. Uh, we we're gonna use a Wake Up Slap. No, that killed him. God damn it! I think fighting is also super effective on ice. What's that's isn't that the type with like the most weaknesses? Is ice? I forgot that that thing looked like an Evangelion for some fucking reason. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's a tower full of ghosts, and I just remember there being one dragon type there. I remember that being cool because you don't usually get dragon types early in a Pokemon game. Second chance, same as the first. You know what? Go, go the fuck to sleep. Ah, hey, you read that book to him. Go the fuck to sleep. You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna catch this guy. Oh, hey, cool. Shit, this guy is... Alright, first I want to make sure Brook doesn't die. Why is its defense is so high? Do I have any special attackers, even? You're fighting a giant robot. Of course its defense is going to be high. Uh-oh. What, for me? No, I got, I got pursued to death. You know what? I'm gonna be toxic. Why am I toxic? Sneezy Bear is mine. What an unfortunate dwarf. Imagine being named just because of, uh, after you sneezing. It sneezed as a kid, and then it was sickly the entire time. That's why it's sneezing. This it's is sneezing. your identity now. Uh. <laughs> this is kind of mean. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna heal, and then I'm gonna attack with the tower. I hope I'm fast enough. Okay, good. Stupid angel. Get in the get in the Pokemon Shinji. <laughs> and your sync ratio with your uh, Lucario is uh, is approaching fifty percent. That's pretty good. The last episode of Hey Arnold Season 1 was a Valentine's Day thing, and it was so fucking anime. It was awful. It was- it was Ranma. It was American Ranma. So sorry. It was just this- they, they were doing the thing where, oh, I made two commitments. I gotta run back and forth between the places at the same time. <laughs> oh, it was yeah. one of those episodes. Who- who- who was the, uh... Who was the Ranma and who were the uh, Akanes? Uh, it was the, it was Arnold had dates with Helga, except he didn't know it was Helga. He, he she was lying. He thought it was her pen pal, and uh, like Ruth, the season one crush. Oh, the one who says I like you, but I don't like you like you. Uh, like, he... Well, he didn't know anything about her, and then he finally met her that episode, and was just like totally shallow, had nothing in common. But it was just extremely cringe comedy all the way through. Just re relationship bullshit. And then they tried to do the thing with Ron at the end where, look, there's there's like a cute moment. That makes it okay. They're, they're good for each other. See? It's cute. But Like, that makes going through all the rest of the shit better. It doesn't. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to mention this now since, uh, I, since I, I happen to know this information. Uh, I... I I don't know if I should bring it up now or until you wait till you finish the. Oh, you, I, yeah, I, I don't care about Zora. Hey Arnold spoilers. Okay, there's a movie. 
Yeah, I, I'm aware. There's two movies. Yes. Well, I've, <laughs> I've seen the first one. I haven't seen the Jungle movie. <laughs> that, that movie is apparently insane. That's like, the, like the recent one, isn't it? I think so. <laughs> Stop earthquaking, Fox. <laughs> Did you reset? Yeah. You re <laughs> Stop for quick. I don't. I gotta train my rock. I can't be taking those hits. Good balance, J. Cool. Yeah, I'm good at this. Oh shit. Yeah, you, you saw that uh, solid JJ video with uh, uh, Mysterion, like, uh, doing the hand tricks to uh, Spider-Man? Uh, yeah, I think so. That that one, I was just, like, imagining what would it, what would happen if it actually worked. Just him doing the pencil thing, and Spider-Man's like, Oh no! What's happening? My reality, it's... It's falling apart right in front of me! I find that amusing. I find that concept amusing. Oh, can you heal me? No. I want to can see a, a video of like increasingly obviously magical or just supernatural shit happening, like from other series. I, I want to see like uh, Dragon Ball and uh, Death Note kind of shit, and Kaiba insisting that none of it's real. <laughs> Ka Kaiba in in uh, debunk in Kaiba. Seto Kaiba and Debunk or something, or Mythbusters. Oh, hello. We rotate. What? What the fuck? Did you just, like, run into a guy who just did this? What? There's what? not, like, any introduction to these types of battles? He's like, I'm gonna confuse you. This is the triple battle you were talking about. This is one of the types of triple battles. So, how this can work is that your opponent has the... You and your opponent have the opportunity to rotate before any turn, any attack. So they could stay with the Lipard, or they could change before your attack into one, their attack into one of the others. Okay. This is actually kind of clever. I like this. Hey, I got the first one. Okay, oh, I escaped up. the horse. <laughs> I'm just trying to get to the fucking tower. I think they're all dark type. I'm gonna try and wake up slap again. Oh, you're tormenting me, okay. on shows. Owl House the finale is out, but we haven't watched the very final episode yet. Yeah, and I'm, I'm honestly, I'm keeping my expectations um, tempered mid. Yeah, because I, I expect it'll be good, but it's probably not going to be great. Yeah. You know? It's the show, the show, the show got, the show got fucked over so bad. I'm so disappointed, but I'm sure, I'm sure it'll end satisfyingly. It just, it just won't expand on certain things I would have liked to expand on. Amphibia, we just finished Season 2. Yeah. So, um, still going okay. We haven't had a chance to watch a whole lot of stuff because, you know, I was busy for the past couple of weeks moving and figuring out my, how my new schedule would work. Yeah. How's the uh, un unpacking going? Ugh, tormented shit. Uh, I got my locker uh, bought and paid for for the month, so I got to move a few things. What the fuck? How'd I get... what do you do to me? I was... I... I, I moved... To... I don't know, but it's psychic flying, so fighting is doing one quarter. Psychic, huh? Okay. Crunch. Yeah. Suck it. Hey, Musashi leveled up.
Did I overthink it because of unfamiliar rules? Wait, you're the one who sprung these rules on me, asshole. That can't be the first, like, rotation battle. Surely there's someone who's supposed to explain it to you before that. Nope. Just him. So, this route continues on to the right. I think the tower was over on the left there. Can you heal me, please? I need healing. Granny's meals are always nothing but vegetables. Please, I need healing. Heal me. Don't you people have Thank beds? You. Thank you. <laughs> hey, Diablo damn. 4 finally happened. Oh, uh, microtransaction laid in that bet. I'm not interested. Yeah. The game I'm currently playing is a uh, game called Jupiter Hell. Yeah? What is it's, it? Uh, so, there's this, you know, uh, the roguelike genre has, like, kind of exploded in popularity over the past decade. Yeah. Um, but before that, there was, like, NetHack, which was, like, old school, like, ASCII art sprites, turn-based stuff. And uh, somebody took that concept and made a roguelike uh, using Doom as a base called Doom Roguelike. And that was going well for a while, and then I guess they were worried about people shutting it down because, you know, it was a fake game. It, <sighs> they, it so they decided, doesn't really do that, do they? Well, they're owned uh, by Bethesda now, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. So they decided, hey, we're going to remake it from the ground up, we're going to give it better graphics, we're going to streamline it a little bit, and we're going to take the concepts of the game and just make it, like, like better and more expanded. And so they did that, and it was a game called Jupiter to Hell and went on sale recently, and I grabbed a copy. I've been enjoying it so far. All these squares make a circle. All these squares make a circle. Oh no. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to hurt you. Ah! Okay, well. You know what? Do I have any... Tail slap, huh? That's a signature move. I don't know why it needed to be signature move. It's nothing special. It's like it's cutting you with like a scimitar or some shit. It's like almost a Pika clone, but not quite. It's normal. From uh, Garfield. This cow makes me angry. Remember Whitney from Gold Silver? Boy, do I. I... <laughs> oh, this cow is gonna. It's gonna fuck me with its new stronger rollout. <laughs> nope, not taking that. Uh, being attacked by kids. Or no, sorry, they're aces. It's not only the encounter race. There's a lot more trainers in this game than previous games. Don't you think? Yeah, it makes it kind of sloggy. Salad, don't mind if I do. Oh wait, that's gra that's grass and I'm ground. I gotta switch out. Hot Kong. Ha <laughs> ha Your bug bites are no effect for the power of fire fighting. There are th I was thinking, there are three types, there are three sides to the force. Really, Master? What what are the three sides? There's the light side, the dark side, and the firefighting side. <laughs> okay. <laughs> just, just a bunch of crazy Jedi je Sith monks just living in a vault like near a volcano. And they just set their, their fists on fire. 
There are Jedi ten won't... kinds of people in the world. Those that understand binary and those who don't. It's gonna be poor. Oh, that's the water type. I don't have any grass. Is that glass cannon number six? What mine? Yeah. Uh, it's it's the rock with the, like huge attack power. Uh oh. It's gonna do huge attack power to itself. Well, no, it's also that did like nothing to it. So this must be a high defense Pokemon that resists Dragon type. What resists Dragon? Oh, it must be Seal. Yeah. I sent out my Kung oh, Fu wow, Kadabra. How are you still alive, lady? Sorry, sir. I just noticed the. Uh... When's my Kadabra gonna evolve? Level 37. It's close. Just keep scalding me, huh? Oh, fuck! He, he crit! Alright, Musashi, just finish. Finish him. Just do the rock smash. Yeah, it's water. I'm on water, so it doesn't matter. Oh, what the fuck? What? Uh, just having shit luck with uh, with my battles. Oh, there's still one more tranquil. It's a bird. You know what? Throw a rock at it. Oh, that's super effective. God damn it. Alright, throw another rock at it. Oh, we're still in the middle of the uh, bleach, the fourth filler arc, which I forgot existed. Oh, yeah, the uh, the, the one with. <laughs> the no, let's talk about arc. Let's talk about this villain. Yeah. Okay. I, Let, let's start from the beginning. It's a it's an arc about mod souls, which I thought was cool. Hey, we can explore those more. Unfortunately, yeah. the execution is kind of just garbage because yes. it's like all mirror matches. And uh, oh. it's an imposter arc. There are there are some good moments because uh, the arc is basically they've uh, cloned, they've taken mod souls and made like uh, bodies of all that are quote-unquote stronger than all the uh, captains and, and people from uh, from the Soul Society. Well, they like keep the saying squad. they're stronger, and then they keep taking blows to their side. They're losing yeah, all the time. Yeah, yeah. That's why I said quote-unquote. So, so there were a couple of good moments. Like, uh, like Hitsugaya was, like, was like patrolling, and then he saw Momohimori. She's like, she's okay. She's out there. And it turned out that uh, they are talking and she was a clone, and then, like, another one came out swinging, and it's like, Hitsugaya, help me! No, help me! And then he makes a choice, and he attacks the one he thinks is a clone, but it turns out they were both clones. And then she's like, I'm sorry, but this, uh, but I was told this was the only way we could defeat you. And that, that was a thing that happened, and he, they still failed. Yeah, because somebody else came. Who was it the game that, like, saved the day? Uh, I, d I think it was another captain. Like, all the non-captain characters have been completely useless. They had, like, five lieutenants on, like, one captain. They just all fail and die. Yeah, so that's basically the arc. And the leader of this crew... What's his name? Kage Rosa. Kage Rosa. He's, like... He is basically... We have Aizen at home. <laughs> Aizen. He does have that kind of energy, because he is as smug as Aizen, but, but way less charming. It's great. It's great. As likable as Aizen is, this guy is hateable. 
I, I, and I, he also wears the stupidest looking fucking outfit. I called him the Wonderland Pope. Yeah. And what it is, his on fuck toe is fucking crazy. It has the ability to, like, copy attacks that other, like, uh, people do against him. And when he say copy, I don't mean he just, like, just does the motions. I mean, he literally, like, summons, like, the people who made the attack as a stand against the other person. It's great. It's like, it's like Kirby, except he can absorb the force and then send it back as many times as he wants to. Yeah. Which is so, not, which is, it's a nice power. Is it enough to be, like, the big bad in a post-Eisen world? I don't know about that. He gets his shit wrecked constantly. <laughs> it's great. I love it when villains... But he acts cut. like he's always in control. It's all part of the plan. He loses all his guys. All Yep, it's all part of the plan. Fucking, uh... Fucking, of all people, uh... Kurosuchi, <laughs> get, Kurosuchi gets the upper hand on him by pretending to be one of the clones. And the guy acts like it's no big deal. <laughs> I forget, did we make that joke about Aizen? Like, he always acted like he was it, everything was according to plan, even when it wasn't? Well, the, the difference between Aizen and this guy was with Aizen, you believe it. Yeah. Because things work out better for him. Despite the fact he lost, he actually came out ahead most of the time. It's only at the very end when he didn't. Whereas this guy, he just loses things, and he just acts like it's no big deal, despite the fact he's not really making any gains. The only real game he made gain he made was like at the very end and when he finally gets his goal the tag along girl they've been protecting who is not a very likable character to be honest yeah well I mean she started off kind of aloof and then she just is like uh, okay I will oh hey finally a good a good fucking move finally uh, do I replace mud slap or sand tomb uh, what is it? Dig? Uh, yeah, probably sand tomb. Yeah, because that's like your damaging ground move, right? It kind of sucks. It's it has use uh, for just dealing damage, but uh, yeah, accuracy is more of a trump card. Axu. Oh god, that's that uh, dragon type. That is a dragon type. <sighs> but it's also like a it's a baby dragon. It's fine. Baby you take it. I use this one in short in sword shield. It's it's weird because it's not a pseudo legendary. It's not one of those dragon types with like huge stats, but it does have huge attack stat. Like that's where all of its stats went. How's it? Not okay, as bad as fail. like Rampardos, who is like so min max that it has an entire theorem named after it. Oh, Jesus. That that hurt. And I'm not faster than it anymore because it scary faced me. Shit, I gotta... I gotta switch out. So, uh, Rampardos was one of the Gen 4 fossil Pokemon. Oh, yeah, and, was uh, it? It was, like, all, it, all attacks that highest attack of, like, any Pokemon, but it has nothing else going for it. And it's so legendarily shitty that, uh... The Rampardos Theorem has become a catch-all name for all of those kind of, like, all power, but it doesn't matter because I can't use it in, like, any uh, video game. Awesome, but impractical. Or, like, Ganondorf in Smash Brothers. Yeah, he hits really hard, but against good players, he'll just get juggled into infinity, infinity so it doesn't matter. This guy is wrecking my shit. Oh, he's fine. He's, but, but he's so cute, though. You, you should... Shouldn't be causing trouble for anybody. What? He's still alive! God damn it! This motherfucker. Okay, good. This puffball just body checked me. Gonna bet there's no doctors in this tower. Flare Blitz. Oh. That is a very strong move. High recoil, but who cares? It's really strong. 75... 120, okay. Uh, Let's go get rid of Thrash. Down. Yeah. I, I think you get rid of Thrash over Facade. 
Oh no, facade. Oh, facade okay. is 70 power. Thrash locks you in though. Yeah. Flare bullets would be like your go-to unless there's a reason you don't like can't manage to damage yourself. Oh nothing. Uh, your character is already a glass clan. He's kind of already all or nothing. Yeah. Activate the rail gun. Okay. Gan is back. Uh, uh Gan yes. York. What? Yeah. That's ar arguably Tears of the Kingdom spoilers, but I don't think anyone's watching anyway, so. Okay, we are. Or, I, I, guess... I don't care. I realized the other day that I've never been, like, in an online community for the release of a Zelda game. <laughs> like, Breath of the Wild released before I started using Discord. It was that long ago. They say that when you ring the bell on top of this tower, it pleases the resting spirits. Good to know. Is this is this the lavender tower? Is that where we're at? Yeah, this is a graveyard. So it's of ghosts instead of dragons. You don't understand. This place is haunted. Haunted by dragons! True. Haunted by dragon. Oh no! This is a haunted treasure cave of the dragon. Haunted by what? A dragon. It's not like we say that we go to a, like a like a mansion that's like possessed by ghosts and be like, "This is a ghost's lair. This is a ghost's treasure hoard." Well, I found a Pikachu. It can summon sandstorms. I eat ghosts. Oh, I burned. God damn it. Well, that sucks. Oh, shit. I have a way to heal. I do not have a burn heal. You don't got a full- what about berries? Yeah, I, I probably have a bunch of berries, but I don't use. We have... Cherry, Pesto, Pizza. You got one, one burn berry. <sighs> this is so dumb. Just one. Oh wait, oh. Whoa! Indescribable energy is flowing to me. It's a medium, right? Oh, psychic. Oh, the alien. Probably know the answer to this. Which, uh, so which do you prefer between uh, sprite-based Pokemon and uh, 3D? Just graphically. <sighs> Honestly, the 3D stuff plays be plays better, it, like yeah. the, because of its design. Because I don't know, like three like 2D Pokemon's good, but I feel like a lot of the problems I have with it are just limitation limitations of like 2D engines, like, like the being way able to see Pokemon encounters. Yeah, I like to be able to see Pokemon encounters and like actively choose, like like a real like a, like a real trainer would. They would just kind of like find the Pokemon they want and then like go towards it as opposed to just like wandering around and hoping the right Pokemon comes to them. There's like an element of hunting with the 3D stuff. Um, what was I doing? Oh yeah, I was eating this guy. Girl, sorry. Yep. Next. Solustus oh no! Is... They are haunted by dragons! Oh, this thing. Yeah, let's eat it. 
Come Your on. crocodile's eating my Pokemon! I'll try catching the Garchomp. What the fuck? <laughs> eating it now! Oh, sorry, it's reflecting. You've seen this one once before. Yeah, it just, it looks weird and, oh wow. It is a very this, this weird is looking a, Pokemon. This is some gamey meat. Oh. Yo, Garchomp got Wonder Guard. You're easy, Master Ball. I don't think I need to resort to Master Ball. I'll try an Ultra Ball. I like how it's still got its arms out like bleh, even when it's sleeping. Bleh. <laughs> yeah, because it's a ghost. It's a ghost dragon. What if it is? Dragon, it could dragon be. Dragon ghosts leave this place. Oh, if I got a dark ghost type with Wonder Guard. Right, I'm leaving now. Hey, what you got it? it. What's what's the typing? Electric. Electric. Okay, so it's only weak to ground. It can only be hit by ground moves. That's pretty good. God. It's like it's like fighting Inaru. Oh, if I had like an air balloon, <gasps> I could do the thing that breaks the game. Yeah, air, yeah, do it. You you will be literally Inaru. Well, it's a it's a lady dragon though. Okay, you'll be you'll be gender swapped Inaru. It'll be fine. Just name it Inaru. Okay. Just or, or don't. Sorry. You know what? what? She's not very dragon-like, but she's electric, and flies, and that's my goal. I gotta make Lum fly. God. I uh, don't think I mentioned on stream my uh, work schedule changed over the course of the previous month. We had spring break, and the preschool I drive for is so understaffed that they had to totally restructure the program. So that instead of a full week, now there's two classrooms. Or there's two groups, rather. There's like a Monday-Thursday group and a Tuesday-Friday group. So the short of it is I'm driving a lot more, and it's been kind of hectic. Yeah, and... Is also why I have not had a lot of time for things. I've kind of gone down to uh, like one highlight video every two weeks. I'm kind of filling out with clips. Still on my current job. Man, I didn't fight these guys. I go through the grass. This house I think we're done. I think we're done after this tower. Yeah. Yeah. But that that cave just really just broke you. That cave took. I was. That cave just drained me, and then I saw it. It was only like like under two hours, and I'm like, really? That felt way longer. I'm like, I'm like, I don't believe you. No. 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 This is a lot of encounters and a lot of trainers to not have more like healing spots or something around here. I just remembered something. You want you want energy? I'll give you energy. Eh? I just remember you were so you know that uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles remake that played around the 2000s on Cartoon Network. The on Nickelodeon. The new Teenage. No, it wasn't on Nickelodeon. It was on like the Maguzi time slot of of Cartoon Network. It was, okay. Yeah, it was I, I know the Maguzi one. Yeah, so that one, uh, that one had a side character who I who I felt so bad for. Yeah. I don't, I don't know if you have you watched that show. No, I never did. Okay, so so that guy, there's this guy, this doctor. I don't remember his name. Let me a second. I'm gonna look this. I'm gonna look this guy up. Uh, this is content. Okay, uh, please allow, no, okay, let's see, comics, yeah, I, I don't want comics, where is this, where is this, where are the shows, first cartoon, the second cartoon, here we go, 
2003 to 2009, teamed up with uh, with the uh, four kids. So you know that it'd be crazy. Um, team and T2K3. Uh, characters. Come on. Yeah, Baxter Stockman. <laughs> Is this the replaces body parts guy? Yeah. <laughs> so so he he had he was like a good like a brilliant scientist, right? He worked for the Foot Clan, and then like one time the Shredder's like, "You failed me, and I'm gonna punish." He's like, "No, no." And the next time you see him, he's wearing an eye patch and like he's got like scarred or something, and then, and then he failed again. And the next time you see him, he's in a wheelchair, <laughs> and I think. I don't know what happens because I, well, I skipped a bunch of episodes. The next time we see him, he's just a head on, on like a spider robot. <laughs> the, the four team and team people, they look at him and they're like, oh, well, this guy's not a threat. <laughs> yeah, was he? Well, yeah, he had, he had like gadgets and stuff, but finally... Uh, like, they had a robot uh, friend with them that mimicked the Shredder's voice. And it said, ignore all commands from Shredder. And Baxter Stockman's like, I'm free! I don't have to listen to you anymore! And he attacked and he shocked Shredder or something. While Shredder's like, no! No! And then... <sighs> so, this Baxter dude helped them save the day from Shredder or whatever. And then and then the final one, you see him. They're, like, raiding this ship, right? And then, and then they're like, they hear a familiar voice, and it's a brain in a jar with eyes, and it's Baxter Stockman again. And then the guy, I don't remember which turtle found him, but he's like, wow, Baxter, you really let yourself go. But That's just the mafia dude from Hat in Time. <laughs> he got Baxtered. Yeah, I guess at some point he becomes like a cyborg? Yeah. Okay, <laughs> so that he goes back from the, the brains and eyes. <laughs> Enough to like have like a, a body again at least. I I like as far as villains go, this guy this guy's just hilarious. Uh, this isn't good. This is a good uh good like uh resolution. But uh, here's all the forms of Baxter Stockman. Oh whoops. Uh, come on. There we go. Hello Reggie. Hello Enzom. I see you. I didn't want to interrupt Jack's story. Fucking hilarious. So yeah, uh, that's the, that's the tale of uh, of the most unfortunate villain <laughs> I've seen at the time. That's like uh, Doctor Nefarious's backstory in uh, Ratchet and Clank, kinda. Like he slowly replaced his body parts over time. Well, and it wasn't that... did that too. What? What? You brought your kid to a graveyard, like as a day trip? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay, well, I got, uh... Maybe, maybe they're vi visiting the kid's mom. Maybe she got killed by a hollow. What do you know, Jack? Oh, the kid's mom was in yeah. a Pokemon? A hollow, the hollow Pokemon. I guess that raises a good point. We never see human graveyards, do we? Humans are built different in the Pokemon-verse. That's right, they're immortal. Birdier. Birdier. It's a dog. The normal. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna just do fighting type then. Transferring a Pokemon to from Black 2 to Pokemon Home. Oh, good luck with that. I, I, I'm not willing to... I, 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 have, I stopped using the, uh, the transfer services once they stopped having the national decks, because I, I don't want to pay $20 a year to have my Pokemon hostage on a server. Uh oh. Oh! Heard of your fight, huh? I had like a full living decks in Gen 7, and now they're back on my Gen 7 cartridges because I got nowhere else to put them. Rock Smash. How good is Rock Smash? 85. Eh, that's okay. Oh it's no, I'm sweet. pathetic. No, my Kung Fu Kadabra does okay, not need I'm just Rock gonna, Smash. I'm just gonna go to the top of the tower. Rush top. You didn't really think it would be that easy, did you? I never think anything's easy in this game anymore. Poor, 
Can you imagine Team Rocket was like that? Every time they lost, you just come back even more fucked up. Giovanni, like, I, you must be punished. <laughs> no, no, because... Jesse, what happened to your left hand? That's the price of failing Team Rocket. They I have like nothing left by the end of Season 1. The thing is, Shredder can just kill him. He just, like, hurt him and is like, Okay, do you know not to fail me again next time? Giovanni was extremely forgiving. He probably did... just, like, didn't bother. How many ranks were between those guys and Giovanni? Well, they didn't Rocky report even... directly to him, right? Yeah, it's all middle management and shit. Like, we could kill him, but... Stop plotting and attack me. What does Mummy do as a... It, uh, it, it's just, it's basically an ability infection. Oh. So it just replaces your ability. Temporarily, right? Yeah, well, until you finish the battle. Shit, this game... Curse. Goldet, that is... Goldet is ground ghost. Ground. Water. I would use this guy, but he's been cursed, so... Oh, the golem dude! I remember this guy. This guy looked cool. The evolved form apparently has rocket jets in its feet. That tracks. Me and a lot of other people never really knew until I think they animated something about it in 3D. Yeah, it's just the Iron Giant. If it's attacked with like intent to kill, then it activates like a like a like total assault mode. Apparently, uh the Iron Giant's, like, ultimate move when it builds up all its scraps in multiverses is that it goes into that assault move and a teammate can jump inside and pilot it. Ooh! Which means yeah. that if you have same characters on, you can have an Iron Giant piloting another Iron Giant. <laughs> oh. I'm gonna That's take... a trap. Oh, hey! Spell tag! Give it back. You are. Oh, gee, how did you guess? Wait! My guy knows dig! I can just get the fuck out of this place anytime I want to without having to go back to the entrance now. You just come out covered in bones, but that's a small price. I had to leave early. You desecrated the entire. You desecrated like 15 graves! Look, my guy was gonna die. Lucky chant. Oh, shields from crits. Okay, I don't need to crit, though. Oh, there's a nurse. Oh, I was right next to her when I left. I didn't see her. Wait, where's the nurse? On the bottom of your screen. Oh, oh shit. You, just gotta, you gotta beat two trainers to utilize her. I'm here to understand the end of the world, but I don't quite get it. I have a battle, will I be- Hey, uh, Fred! <laughs> <laughs> the ending is just, is just like, <laughs> Fred just, God. I wonder if Solid JJ has gotten, like, uh, copyright notices. Because he's been using a lot of original, like, animation drawings lately. Like, oh, but... Like, I not think... still frames from old shows. Well, I think it's fine. He chooses stuff that mostly people don't care about anymore. Yeah. If he would have gotten copyright strikes, he would have, it would have happened already. He's just using still images, and the voices aren't even, like... The uh, Oppa video finally got recognized by Viacom. Didn't got taken down or monetized or anything, but... We know what you've done. We'll be watching you. 
How dare you defile our sky bison? It did it to itself. Um, Kappa screwed up. Uh. All right, nurse, what do you got? Psychic type. I can eat this. We've stayed pretty even this entire stream. Well, yeah, both are equal slot. Well, I mean, I'm taking my time, and you're dealing with some bullshit. Alo, Almo Moala. It's a fish. Shit, I don't have anything really strong against water. Uh, it's, I think it's like a special defender. You can probably just like hit it hard. <laughs> okay. Buggy, oh, let's go. Is Kenny Rogers just there for HMs? I think, yeah. I mean, I guess takedown could like take it out, take out a lot of things. Oh, protect. That's nice. It's a support Pokemon, which is a weird concept. I mean, doubles exist, but. Oh, confusion water pulse, damn it. It also looks like so much like an evolution of Love Disc. I'm offended it's not. <laughs> this is a, just look at it, you go, this is offensive. Oh, wow, come this on, thing... you could have given Love Disc something. Give it this. It's doing nothing. This thing's doing nothing. This thing can take, like, a hit. Wow. It also really looks like it belongs in the Hawaii region, but that didn't exist yet. Alright, this isn't working out. I gotta switch out. Why, why are its fins hands? I don't like that. It's like, it's like a weird Kikimura, uh, like, double. Double Kikimura, like, head. I might want to get this thing because it has speed boost. Nah. Oh wait, bug. Let's try this. Oh, that's right. I gotta check on my. Uh, I gotta check on my wonder guard. Did not work. Oh, you got a oh, slap too. God. Ah, yeah, fuck it. I'm about to heal. Did it just slap you with its fin hand? Yes. It is, in fact, hands. Yep, lower defense. I want to see this thing handshake with an ant with an apom. <laughs> that would be funny. Go down! <laughs> this thing is tough. It's like trying to destroy, like, a... Does it not have any non-water moves? Why <laughs> What an annoying tra- Is this the nurse? This is the nurse. Okay. Okay, defense has gone down again. Alright. Uh, well, no, I don't want to run. Sorry. It's gone into its second form. Rock smash. That'll get its defense down. Yeah, so will Razor Shell. This guy! Alright, I'm gonna have to retreat. Uh... Oh, I got it. Kenny Rogers, take down. Suicide run. Okay, what does my nurse have? Okay, cool. And... Take down! Take down this fucking fish. Damn it, still alive! And Kenny Rogers get K, K Rogers is down. Crocs fast. I, I, I think a side, I think a Zen Headbutt will can take it down. Mine has a penguin. She's got more Pokemon. Protect, huh? Uh, this is. This is aggravating.
Yay, finally, it's dead. Buggy, what is your level up? Rock slide! That's, strong, that's stronger than rock throw, right? Yeah, 75 versus 50. And it may also make him flinch. Just better yeah, sure. rock throw. Yep. Took like five Pokemon to take it out. That was that was rough. Your team is really healthy. It is now. That it was support Pokemon is right. It's like it's like a frigate. Like a frigate with like five point defense. Like it's gonna shoot down all the missiles. What guard do I have against a bug? Uh, enough with the fucking ghosts. I'm done with this shit. How tall is this tower? These are ace trainers. Surely this is the last floor. Can't wait to run into our stalker and at the top. So we meet again. Why are you up here? I just fought you like oh, five minutes no. ago. I have to fight I have to fight Duke Duke Dog McFuckface. Alright. Let's try to Oh, take down. Great. Sec. Meanwhile, I'm slogging through this bug penguin, and he's probably gonna like hyper potion now. Oh, it was no, nothing. He's... It was it was a prank call yeah. from China. I mean, at least I assume because I can't understand Chinese. Uh, it's, you, it's ever just those, a... uh, you ever get those? You ever get those calls? One, no. You know, you don't get calls from, like, China, just in Chinese, like, just for no reason? Nope. Yeah, it's weird. Alright, uh, fuck, this guy is... Oh, well, he's normal, so I'll just... My nurse just has a team of penguins. <laughs> it's a better deal, I'd, I'd rather fight penguins than that fish again. Did she only have the the one Pokemon? Uh, no, she had two. The second one was way worse. Jeez, these dogs! It just break yourself upon me. I was worth a lot. A little revive. Right, we wanna go back down and heal again. That fucking trainer. Oh my god. Living candle. I like how it's got like an emo haircut. Yeah, it's pretty it's a pretty cool touch. Thank you. 
Boy, today sure was a day. We got lost in a cave. We got ambushed by ninjas. A stalker was there. And then now we're climbing up a tower. Why Why are all the Pokemon graveyards towers? Who knows? It seems impractical when you think about it. Well, keep battling. Land is scarce in the Pokemon verse. They call them sky burials. Maybe the graves are just, like, uh, symbolic. When Pokemon die, they just fade into energy or something. Yeah, and then they just, they just chisel away at a stone and be like, Hey, this is, this is, this person died recently. It's gonna be a boss battle up there. I remember this tower being shorter. Maybe I was overleveled at the time. Scary face! That just dro harshly drops somebody's speed. That seems useful. You think it's more useful than Swagger? I would use Swagger more. Okay. I haven't been using Swagger at all, honestly. Swagger or uh, Mudslap both come in handy in a pinch. Yeah. Shadow Claw. Cool. That's, That's a physical ghost move. Heck, that might be good for the uh, crocodile. Another level. Alright. Now we're up to the top. We can save this. Okay. Oh wow, this is high. We're over the clouds. What the fuck? Oh, Bronzor. Oh, okay. Oh, that's we not... don't even get to see the Pokemon. Pokemon's fine. Don't worry about it. I'm a pilot. Oh, that's a flight suit. No, I don't want to fight your fucking Kakuna. I got a bell to ring! Wait, we really had to come up here just to ring a, ring a bell. Do I have to go all the way back down to the random encounters again? You can dig, right? Let's try it. Yeah, I'm gonna try digging. Hey. Bro, you just dig through the stairs. Can't use that here. Okay, you, maybe you don't have I... fly, do you? I don't. Do you have an escape rope? No. Damn it. <laughs> Best gen. Flawless. Even in Gen 2, they had the Sprout Tower, and they were kind enough to say, hmm, you know, this is kind of a pain to get back down again. Let's put an escape rope at the top. This one, it's like, oh, well, fuck you. People are saying our games are too easy. We gotta make them harder. Well, there's difficulty, and then there's annoyance. Diffi annoyance is not difficulty. You know what I can do in Dark Souls? I can I can run around enemies if I don't feel like fighting them. Yeah. Sometime, well, most of the time. The real difficulty was fighting the bosses, and the, and that was 
That was fun shit, fighting bosses. Dark Souls with random encounters. <laughs> I don't know how that worked, but I'm sure it'd suck. Well, what happens is you walk and then the screen flashes and then you just, and then there's an arena where you do like a fight with like a Dark Souls uh, enemy. And then it ends. And you have to do a, like a, like a dice roll to see if you're able to leave the arena. Flawless game, 10 out of 10. Garchomp. I hope this this Wonder Guard Garchomp isn't like worthless everywhere else. Boy, that'd be disappointing. He has like no attack stats. Sorry, she. Hey. Why am I going? It's just Litwick. I've encountered nothing but lit lit Litwicks. You have not once encountered the one dragon that lives here. It's shy. You know what? I'm annoyed. Mm. Oh, it's got an attack stat. That's it's got no defense, though. It's got. Oh, you're right. It has no defense. Plenty of special defense. Class. Well, fucking cannon. Well, it's got a Wonder Guard, so it does. It shouldn't matter. It will only it, any physical like ground move will just destroy it. Anything else yeah. is fine. So don't fight ground type Pokemon. Uh, fool. Monkey has low stats. Disappointing. Get in my ball. It's a physical attacker. I need physical moves for it. It's all got. It's just got special moves though. I don't need my my fire red ice. <sighs> Can't wait to be done with this. Finally, I'm out. I'm almost out. I'm just leaving. I am out. Okay, Jim. Get... Next time, I am done. <laughs> You're not even gonna go to the Pokemon Center? I uh, there's a there's a not a Pokemon. There's a fucking house. To, like where, like right next to the path, I can just hit that, and then I can go to the gym. I am done with. Okay. <laughs> that was that was a rough stretch. That stretch sucked. Like yeah, I yeah, it's pretty bad. Just like from cave to tower. <sighs> Surely next time will be better. Surely I don't I don't even remember what's go what's next in this game. There's a gym next. We're we're doing That's a gym. And then we're going on to hopefully greener pastures without fucking caves or stalkers or ghost towers. The devil, my the fucking caves is annoying. All right, well that's fun. It's good to stream again, though. Yeah. Just to catch up with with uh, people and stuff. Hopefully we will get a chance next weekend. Yep, I, I, we should. I don't. I'm, I'm my weekends. I'm gonna keep free because I'm like you know traveling and stuff for work and yeah. All right. For now, see you later. See you later.